Oof. Yeah. Big oofs. A <laughs> big oof. Big am oof. I right? Oh, how right, is everyone doing today? No one can answer. No one oh, is that's here. Right. That's right. <laughs> <laughs> Let me make the announcement that I I forgot. I can't, I've been forgetting to do. I'm really forgetting my job lately. And I've been forgetting to do the earlier in the day Discord post uh, for this. Oh, it's my okay. Bad. I'll make you do it. It's... At everyone. We are live with possibly, with, I'll just say most likely, most likely our last episode of Danganronpa. It's fun that you say possibly because I, I very much believe we're going to get this it's done It's going to be our last yeah. one, but I, you never know what could happen. Like right before our last hope fragment, like we could, one of us could suffer, suffer a thing a diarrhea and we have to end really soon that's true that's always possible yeah. it's always it's always <laughs> looming in the back of my mind of like oh god <laughs> please join us for join us i've never noticed this little like animation she does when you exit the menu what does she do oh oh don't cry <laughs> I also find it fun because uh, Usami has not around. changed at all. Yeah. Oh, look, she's so cute. I think it's. I don't think. Um, like, I'm not sure if they can die in in this uh, realm. You yeah, know, that's, that's true. Bonus realm. Because it's not technically. We're not really. I don't know. For one last her uh, cry, and then I'll. The possibility is why I keep coming back. The, <laughs> what? Shrink, the possibility that this is like the last one. Is oh. Like, yeah. I think it's interesting because um, after this, we just were gonna play more visual novels. That's pretty much what it was. Yeah. To. But I am gonna. Uh, we'll talk more about it at the end. Let's but go. I, I, I'm a little sad. This could be the last time we spend with Hajime and the gang. I know. It's gonna be so weird. Yeah. All right, so let's see. Right now, we have two for Soda, and we need to do five for uh, Fihiko and five for Sonya. Like we got this. Yeah. So Soda first, then, yeah. Yeah. All right, let's go find them. Our thinking is we'll do Soda, Fihiko, then Sonya. Oh, Shringa says I meant the thing that could end the stream early. The possibility of us having terrible time. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> uh, <laughs> man. man, I'm a little bored. Are you bored too? Then let's think about how we can kill time. <laughs> Why'd you say it like that? Because <laughs> it's funny. Because it's funny. <laughs> it's funny. <laughs> I, killed some... I killed some time oh, with right. Kazuichi today. Thinking about, I mean, you can, no, you can do no, it no, if no, you want. No, 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 you do it. <laughs> thinking about how to kill time. <laughs> Yes, Ego, let's fucking go. <laughs> Looks like Kazuichi and I grew closer today. He sank his teeth in my jugular. <laughs> oh, let me have um my Kazuichi soda free time. I wonder if he likes soda. He likes number 47, Radio Sond. I got three of those. Oh, well, let's just keep giving him those. <laughs> huh? Are you, you serious? You're gonna give that to me? <laughs> Crap. I'm starting to get really excited here. Yeah. Ah, jeez. Why aren't there any vehicles of vengeance on this damn island? At this rate, I'll, I'll take anything. A go-kart, or a sea toys, a baby carriage. Just let me tinker with something. Ooh, mirror. That sounds really cool. A, a, like a Groundhog Day style... Fan fiction where Soda has to get over his crush on Sonya. Uh. That's fun. Uh, baby carriages don't have engines. There's oh. nothing I can't disassemble, so I took apart the alarm clock inside my room. And when I did that, I couldn't put it back together. Oh, so there are times when even the ultimate mechanic can't fix something. Of course. That sort of thing <laughs> happens to me all the time. 
One time I was stinking around without thinking, and before I realized it, I made some kind of car thing. I invented the automobile. <laughs> One time I fucked around and I made something called a Nintendo Switch. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> For some reason, the things I fix always end up being some kind of vehicle. I don't understand that at all. Ah. Oh. Ah. <laughs> I don't mind messing <laughs> around with the frame of, or connecting the electrical equipment. But guys, definitely need something with a rumble and some bam, bam, bam. Hey, Ajime, you know what I'm talking about, right? Oh, I think I know what you're talking about. You know, it cuts to, like, like Hajime's, like, <laughs> little thought bubble is, like, Patrick riding on the fucking, uh... <laughs> little, like, like, seahorse thing? Yeah. <laughs> I'm glad we both thought the same thing. You know what I really want right now? Bam, bam, bam. Um, Kazuichi's probably talking about, uh... An engine. I mean, probably an engine, but just in case it's a fridge, let me double check. <laughs> <laughs> it's an engine. <laughs> <laughs> Just the case is a fridge. I'm <laughs> so nervous. You're talking about an engine, right? That's what you want to mess around with? That's right. <laughs> That's exactly <laughs> it. Disassemble, reassemble, see how it goes. Disassemble, reassemble, see how it goes. Doing that over and over gets my brain moving. <sighs> I really miss the smell of oil. Maybe that's why he's so, like, like fixated on Sonya, is that his mind isn't able to... He needs an engine or something to tinker with, or else he'll, like, fixate on something unhealthy. That's right. <laughs> You're right, I haven't really smelled anything like that since we came to this island. I understand, Tech. I, I like the tongue, too. I, I think it's funny. Yeah. But even if there was a car here, you couldn't drive it since you don't have a driver's license, right? I don't think. Man, I don't there's, think that's uh, once <laughs> there's no way I do something annoying like that. I'd get just get motion sickness anyway. I just <laughs> really like the feeling of an engine running. <laughs> I like all kinds of machines, but vehicles are definitely the best of the best. After I like his all, eyeliner. They look so awesome. It's just oil. <laughs> Probably. <laughs> Man, I really want to go home soon and start working on my bike again. Oh, you're even making a bike, huh? My dream machine is seriously awesome, you know? According to my calculations, the top speed of 585 miles per hour. Man, I really miss tinkering with that thing. It's so interesting and fun. Like when, this? Yeah, when you're not talking about Sonya. <laughs> yeah, when he's actually talking about his ultimate. <laughs> He's the only one who is. <laughs> oh, but it obviously wouldn't be street legal, and since I get motion sickness, I can't ride in any way. What's the use of making a ride that you can't even use? I don't understand that at all. It's like a model maker, oh. Hajime. <laughs> just, yeah, like... <laughs> like, like the act of making something. I know, like, tinkering and, like, like building something is a lot different than, like, needing it for stuff. I mean, it's just fun to build stuff. It's like, I build Legos. I don't sit there and play with the Legos when I'm done and, uh, like, all look, the time. Like, but... Hajime looks at his kid, and his kid is just like, I built a, I built a rocket out of the Legos. But can you fly it, though? <laughs> and that's a very um, despicable me that, eh. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, uh, we have a line read, by the way. I sleep in a race car bed. Do you sleep in a race car bed? I sleep in a bed with my wife slash husband. Oh. Huh. <laughs> Kazuichi never goes to the dentist because he keeps getting lectured against sharpening teeth. That's a that's a body mod, right? Like people do that. Yeah, I. Ugh, that's. I think the sharpening your teeth would be weird, but I've seen a lot of a lot of people on TikTok I've seen who get the mod where they like add fangs, like canines. Really, like actual, like, like like. Yeah, it's considered a a um, cosmetic thing, so you know insurance wouldn't cover it. But it's like the stuff you make fillings out of, they'll make uh, it look like you have fangs. After talking to Kazuichi for some hot. time, I went back. <laughs> <laughs> I went back into my room. I'm a gal who likes sharp teeth on a on a fictional character. Yeah, I feel that. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh yeah, <laughs> forgot you keep head kidding her is dying <laughs> every morning and every night. <laughs> um, good night. <laughs> <laughs>
The steaming dumpling in the background. Yeah, ste- the steaming ma- dumpling island. I love steaming dumpling island. That was weird how I said that. <laughs> Broom Robo. <laughs> That's right, we have one day to make good ship Usami. <laughs> oh, aren't we like ignoring that? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. I mean, like, I we were so anxious that first time we realized we weren't gonna get one done, and then like literally nothing happened, and now I feel like, why bother? <laughs> Make everyone go to sleepy bye. Yeah. That, yeah oh, that... for us, for sure. All right. Go to sleep. Go to sleep. Go to sleep, little babies. Except, Except uh, anybody <laughs> who's dead, and anybody who's uh, who's. On fire needs to clean. Yeah, everyone else That's gets the to sleep. The one thing we'll do. Yeah. Usami can't make us clean an entire island and like build her a fleet. <laughs> <laughs> like, what the fuck? <laughs> Have, did, did you build me my private yacht? No. <laughs> yeah. Like what the fuck? Build your own boat. <laughs> yeah. Why? Why are we building you a boat? She's again? so like timid in the when when Monokuma's around and those fun. She's pushing us around really yeah. bad. Make me my boat. Do it. <laughs> build a boat, bitch. Build, build, Should be easy build, for build you. Build boat. You better. have three days, fucko. <laughs> you like have to restrain myself because I found out a bunch of Nagido fun facts. Has nothing to do with what we're doing. It's soda time. <laughs> Uh, you should put them in um, the Discord somewhere. Yeah, yeah, or or in chat if you want. I mean, why the fuck not? It's the last episode of Danganronpa too. We might as well, yeah, you know, have some fun. Tech says, "Why doesn't that one guy sleep in his bed?" I I noticed that Nekomaru doesn't actually sleep in the bed. He sits next to it. Maybe it's because I think he's just too huge. Yeah, he's hot. Man, I'm a little bored. You bored? Okay, <laughs> after passionately making out with Soda. Wait, wait, where did it say that? I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Canon. Looks like Kazuichi and I grew a little closer today. Let's give him another radio thing. Here's a radio. 40 something. <laughs> sparkle, sparkle. Oh. I shouldn't eat M&Ms while we're fucking filming. It's okay, I drank like a whole like peach diet coke just now. Oh, but you can't hear that, and Eminem is so No, conscious. you super could. You super can hear it in my mic. You can't hear it on Discord. <laughs> but you, but they can hear the, like, ruffling of ice. <laughs> oh. <laughs> and St. Oddball has a line read for us. <laughs> so, no. I like it. They call me Jaws because no one wants me near their genitals. <laughs> nice. I can, th- I can think of some people who probably do. <laughs> so don't you worry, Soto. There's hope for you yet. Hey, Anjime, do you have a dream for the future or something? Mm, I've never really thought about it. Going to school forever and ever. Maybe I've forgotten what it was. Oh, so <laughs> How about you? Do you have one? Well, you know, sort of, since I'm a mechanic. There's not much a guy like me can do besides tinker with machines. So if I'm going to research the stars, then that's the only... Oh, I'm going to reach for the stars, and that's the only one I'm going to become me. an astrophysicist. <laughs> <laughs> Do you mean an F1 racer? Hell no. Something bigger and faster. Oh, never Aww. mind. Don't even think about it. Wow, we pissed him off. You'll just laugh. You'll definitely laugh <gasps> at me. Never. See? I told you. Your face is totally giving it away. <laughs> I- I'm making a face? Nah. Tech, what a what an amazing way to put it. <laughs> uh, don't you get it? I mean, if I'm talking about the best machine, then I'm obviously talking about that. Just don't even think about it. Forget about it already. I know, I know exactly what it is. Does he want me to guess or not? Um, the thing Kazuichi probably wants to talk about is it's a rocket ship. Could it be a rocket ship? Uh, laugh well, all you want. Is. I don't care. Why would I laugh? That sounds amazing. S- seriously? Oh my god, look at him. He's gonna bluff <laughs> I me, I can tell. <laughs> I see, I see. Don't you think rockets are amazing? They're the biggest and the fastest. They're the very top of the vehicle food chain. But still, there's just one thing I'm worried about. No matter how hard I work to make such an awesome machine, <laughs> there's no way I can give a girl a ride in one. 
Yeah, if you get motion sickness in a car, you'd have a really bad time inside a rocket. But a fantasy like that is very you, I guess. If you ever overcome your motion sickness, I can totally imagine you riding a motorcycle with a girl. You'd probably hang out with a bunch of delinquents and get into all kinds of trouble, too. Wow, why don't, we're kind of a dick. So you, you, so you think so, too. I mean, it's normal to think like that. Kazuichi? Did something happen all of a sudden? It's uh... nothing. I just remembered something I need to do, so... Later! For some reason, Kazuichi abruptly walked away. Almost maybe it's because like we... we said we would hang that he would only hang out with the Linklins. <laughs> yeah, maybe we made it. We imply that he was like a bully of some kind, or like a bad kid. Yeah. <laughs> I don't you really maybe... know <laughs> why his attitude changed. I don't get it. Why is he being such a dick? <laughs> I'm a... What is delinquent? <laughs> Fuck him! <laughs> <laughs> Fuck, it was so rude. I don't understand. Camera, I don't understand why he would fucking leave. I just imply that he fucking is a loser delinquent. Oh my god, what a loser delinquent. How dare. Oh, fuck it. I dare. can't fucking believe this. I can't fucking believe this. While still ah, holding on to some hazy thoughts, <laughs> I decided to go back. I was trying to, like, make, like, the noises where I'm, like, like uh, sipping from the bottom of a cup, and I forgot there was still some at the bottom, so I just inhaled it. <laughs> inhaled it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, shit. Ego oh, shared we... with us a fun fact about Nagito. Yeah, we've got a uh, line read and that, so let's start with the fun fact and then do the line read. Sounds good. Nag uh, from the start, Nagito is planned to be one of the main... To be the main character's foil. His original design was based around the image of a Shinigami, which is like a, a Grim Reaper. Yeah. Uh, the personification of death in Japanese culture. I know that That's because I watched cool. Death Note. I know that because I watch Black Butler. <laughs> I know that because I watch Soul Eater. <laughs> I've run out of things to know that because of... <laughs> Bleach you. Bleach you. <laughs> Burichi. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, okay. And we got our... Uh... Ooh, beta, be, beta, Nag beta. beta Nagito designs. Uh, where can Ego put those in the Discord? Uh, I would say just put them in Media Museum. Media Museum is like a really good place to just put things that are like just yeah. things you want to share. Um, oh, and we also have the line reader. <laughs> Mirror. <laughs> Why do you gotta be... <laughs> you guys know that because you're nerds. <laughs> anyway. Mitchell's crying so hard. All right. Ajime. You want to be Hajime for the no, line? No, 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 no. Oh, okay. I I'm making a face. Soda. It's the stupid, you want to kiss me so bad it makes you look stupid face you give to literally everyone on the island. <laughs> I know this game. You're not going to seduce me. I, I wasn't going to? <laughs> <laughs> All right. Uh, Insane Aval no. says Akane may have been originally planned to be an antagonist in concept because her surname means ending and Hajime's means beginning. That's pretty That's cool. fun. Yeah. Jesus. I guess it does. Akane. Wait. What's her? It's a Wari, right? Yeah. I think. Yeah. yeah. Or something. Yeah. Oh, Sami. But cool. Do you, want, do you want to do scary noises for Sami this time? I don't, I don't think your mic caught it. Yeah, it's because it was too scary. Oh, man. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, God. <laughs> so, oh, good. <laughs> Our goal was one good ship is <laughs> on me. Nope. <laughs> Let's watch her cry about it. Yeah. Was that a little difficult? Fuck. You didn't want to build my time. house, and now you don't want to build, <laughs> build my ship. You want to build me a house? You want to build me a ship? <laughs> yeah. This was supposed to be Nagito. He just looks more like Makoto. Yeah, let me let me see what's up. Let me go into that. Ooh, uh, glasses. Uh. I like his that's like. Fun. He looks like opposite Chiaki with the hoodie. Like it's like a rabbit. Oh, I wish they would have kept bat. his hoodie. That looks so good. Yeah. It's cool. It's like spooky. Yeah. Love it. But it does look even more like Makoto. Yeah. That's really funny. All right. Uh, Evil. All right. The next goal the is. The next goal is. Fuck you. 
Ding -de ding Now you have to build me a giant robot Usami, we that I could kill in. <laughs> Usami, we didn't build you the house. We didn't build you the <laughs> ship. <laughs> we have I think she she's literally like building a fucking army. This is awful. No. All right, all right. Let's uh. We actually the golden plate. I bet. 40 golden plates. I bet that's a rare item, too. Well, we have plenty oh, we of could hammers. Make 17 of, or yeah, uh, 8 of them. Yeah. White, cotton, golden plates, and AI chips. <laughs> well, let's see how everyone's doing. Yeah, whatever you want. Yeah. I say fuck it personally, but whatever you want to do. Nah, I'm gonna send everyone to Nizumi Castle. Okay. Well, maybe not. For cotton? Oh, for. It looks like the, it's just. How do you get the AI chips? They are. Uh, you have to build those? I think we have to build those, yeah. Mm -hmm. I know we're gonna say fuck it ultimately, but I just wanna be like. Let's see, like, what we can actually do. We need 10 AI chips, 40 <laughs> golden plates, and a bunch of white cotton. Mm -hmm. Tech, I thought that the last time we had to get cotton, too. <laughs> I didn't say it. Uh, Mir says, and to think you started out making hair clips, now Usami wants you to make a fucking mech. <laughs> oh, I know. It's so stupid. What a goof. Yeah, fuck it. Everyone, everyone, just go. Just go to the fuck. Go. Everyone, go to Electric Avenue. Let's do it. Yeah, fuck it. Everyone, everyone's gonna party together at Electric Avenue, except for you. Who is going to clean? <laughs> there we go. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Sorry, so much text. Oh, actually. Ego dropped another fact. Nagato is developed into a warped person displaying themes such as the fear of someone you can't empathize with, slash, someone that can't empathize, contradictions, and inverse hope. According to Kodaka, it requires courage to draw a character holding contradictions, yet once I got over that, I actually enjoyed making the portrayal. That's pretty cool. Hmm. That's pretty cool. Oh, we're, yeah. we're, we're soda. Oh. You passed him. You passed him. Mm -mm. All right, soda. Let's hang out. Soda. Ah. 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 This will be my last Definitely. character I voice too. Oh my god! Oh god! Stop! Let's. Don't talk about it. <laughs> Somehow I already am losing confidence in myself. Oh my god, it's been a day. Look at your ready egg eyes. Well, it's not like I had any confidence to begin with. Damn it, why did this have to happen? I just want to go home already. Aw. Kazuichi seems pretty depressed, both physically and mentally. Get a hold of yourself, man. I'm sure there must be some way. Get a hold of yourself. <laughs> Are you slapping? Are yeah. you making slapping, yeah, slapping sounds? Noise, All right. Yeah. <laughs> cool. I thought so. I was thinking the same thing. Come on. You know what they say? <laughs> They're missing you know what they? <laughs> but they? Where there's a will, there's a way. But not a say, right? <laughs> Hajime. Isn't that kind of lame? <laughs> You're a dick. It, it's your fault for complaining. Mir says, does Hajime slap his face or slap his ass? That's for you to decide. <laughs> Yay! Go, fanfic writers! Well, that's <laughs> true. Sorry. Sure? Alright, let's get Punk to look for a way to escape. And save the crown and Mr. Krabs! Now that we're mad. Sure we have <laughs> facial hair now that we're mad. Now that we're mad. I changed my underwear now, now that, that we're mad. <laughs> we have a manly flair. Mr. Krabs. Sure covers quickly. 
Uh, we never had a chance when we were kids. <laughs> <laughs> we'll take a look at what you saw me did. <laughs> <laughs> yes. <laughs> But still, the machines here are... me. <laughs> but still, all the machines here that have engines like airships and... Airplanes, airships. Airships. <laughs> airplanes and ships, they're no good. You might as well put paddles on the ship and a pedal boat and off this island. We could even make a swan ship. Make it, make it swan shape, too. Not a bad idea. What do you mean, might as well? Ah, uh, that reminds me. How to get yelled a lot for modifying various things at school or at home. My greatest invention was attaching an engine to the machine that draws the chalk lines on the soccer field. Yeah. But, uh, it escaped through the school entrance at full speed without curving or stopping. Obviously, you'd be yelled after that. Hey, Hajime, if by chance... Ah. Uh... What if it's impossible? That Monokuma bastard's rule is the only is that only one person is able to escape. Mm. But that rule doesn't matter. We will never kill someone. <laughs> it's that simple, right? That's true, but can you really believe that nobody here will ever betray us? I hate this. If you start doubting now, you'll never stop. They want you to feel like this. Oh. Well, obviously, but. Humans are creatures that betray each other, you know? If they aren't, then... Kazuichi? What does that mean? S sorry uh... Think about... Let, let me think about it alone. Aww. After saying that, Kazuichi briskly walked away. I understand why he's worried, but... I feel like he's worried about something else. But I guess for now, I should just wait until Kazuichi feels comfortable talking about- talking to me about it. Mm. <laughs> Kazuichi, that's kind of fucked up. Uh, so ow! Sorry. Why'd you slap my ass? <laughs> tech 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 It's a line I decided that's- that's tech's, um, nickname. Sorry, I was- I was busy. Uh. You didn't say, like, usually you're like, okay, line read, but this time you just went into it, and I just thought it was totally normal for you to say, ow, why'd you slap my ass? <laughs> <laughs> oh, I see it now, okay. <laughs> it's a good ass, and it seemed like a good idea at the time. I know I have a good ass, but it still hurt. <laughs> you gotta see Beta Teru Teru? I'd love to. Yeah, that sounds interesting. He's like a worse looking monster person. <laughs> Wars, like what we got is. Oh, what if he was actually really handsome and they like decided against it? <laughs> <laughs> I'm not Today building. Today is your day off. I'm not building Yay. this robot. <laughs> like what we say that to her. I wish we could. <laughs> Real quick. <Yeah>. Okay. <laughs> Let's look at how much love, love loves each other. Everyone love, love loves each other. <laughs> Beta Terra Terra was really pretty. Oh, we have the... Guess who has the hots for us the most? Ugh. Wow. What does this mean? Like, what did we do? Me. You can raise your love love level with someone if you use a trip ticket and I... Oh, we use trip tickets on them. Oh. However, you cannot gather hope fragments when you do this. Even if your love love level is full, it won't mean anything if you don't have enough hope fragments. Okay, so it's you take those people to different locations and raise them. Mm -hmm. What what if like that's why and raise come, them? What do you what if that's why Soda wears the jumpsuit? Is because he's like he needs to protect his ass. How is that gonna protect his ass? So that no one will see it. <laughs> So no one will see it. Yeah. Uh, What's wrong with his ass? Is it like horribly deformed? No, it's perfectly shaped. <laughs> oh no. It's like the perfect bubble butt. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, there was another fun fact in the chat. Oh, what's up? <laughs> Ooh, uh, Ego says that Nagito's like facial expressions were inspired by his Japanese voice actress. Um, and the character designer made a lot of alterations because she like went batshit in the voice booth. They were like, oh, hell yeah, that's awesome. <laughs> I love that. I love when like animations or artwork is based off of the 
um, performance in, in the voice booth. That's so fun. Oh, sorry. That's probably something he'd like, but let me double check. Yeah. Just in case he wants a refrigerator. Um, yep, he likes that reactor thing. He, li he likes this common Rider belt? Yeah, yeah, I thought it was some kind of pretty ribbon. <laughs> huh, are you serious? You're really gonna give me that? Crap, I'm getting really excited. Yeah. Uh, Hajime, <laughs> is that how you interpret him? <laughs> no. Uh, Hajime, about that thing from before. Hey, let's go somewhere. Doing? I'm like, this, this, this is, is this one. is his last one. Oh Shit. my god. Let me look at what, if there's anything I need to think, keep in mind. Oh, well, we didn't give him water. You you get to be him for his last roll. That's, we, we got mirror, mirror, uh, swapped voices. Oh, oh, I feel bad taking from, this from you, Mitchell. Oh, it's okay. After he said that, Kazuchi walked away by himself. Oh, I need to put a timer on. Unless you want to just run out the time. No, it's okay. Something. I ran after <laughs> Kazuichi my... until I arrived at the beach. Ooh, wait, can you save here? There's, um... I want to... Uh... Choose an option that is not the right answer. And see what he says. Okay. Ooh! <laughs> Sucks. Ha! What are you doing? Can't you see? I'm breathing deeply. Oh my god. Nah. I, I gotta prepare myself for lots of reasons, you know. Alright, I'm ready. Come at me, bro. No, hold on. I don't really understand what's going on at all. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Dumbass, isn't it obvious? There's only one thing for two men to do when they come to the beach. Fuck? W what? Hmm. Date? This isn't the right answer, but I want to say date, and then we can go back. The real answer is fist fight. I see. This is a date, huh? <laughs> That's right. Two people having fun at the beach will eventually get close to each other, and then... Wait, you and me? What will happen if I dream about that tonight? <laughs> I just want to lighten the mood a little. Hmm. What can two men do at the beach each? Okay, wait, all right, we should go back and... No, no, and, no, it'll be fine. And not fine. have chosen the wrong answer. No, no, I'll be fine. I I, I think it'll be fine. <laughs> Sid Hotball says, choose the wrong answer and Soda tears your dick off with his teeth. <laughs> oh, God. Are you talking about a fist fight? Uh... Not exactly. You're going to punch yourself. Huh? <laughs> oh my, nah. If you don't, my mind won't be settled. It's like I feel lost or something. So why do we have to... You believe in me, but I can't believe in you at all. It's like I betrayed you or something. Kazuichi. <laughs> hey, to be honest, I'm wearing contacts. What? What is this now? <laughs> what? <laughs> It's not like my hair is this color because I wanted it to look like this. I wasn't really sure what I wanted, so I just tried a few things and it ended up like this. This is the most, like, this is the biggest twist. This is worse than, like, anything M. Night Shyamalan could ever dream of. I had no idea, like, what? Oh. So, what, like, is Pecos natural? <laughs> uh, interesting. I was always a weak, cowardly kid. All I ever did was study and tinker with machines. So I always believed that everyone who talked to me was a nice person. Oh, Ego says he's a glasses boy. I thought he meant like, I'm wearing color contacts. No. Is that no, what, no. That's what he means, right? No, he's wearing like, contacts for glasses. Because he said, this isn't my natural hair color. Yeah. So I assume because his hair and his eyes are the same color that he also means I'm wearing color eye contacts. No, I just assumed that he was wearing contacts like for glasses. Oh, okay. I really thought that's funny. Unless like it's prescription color contact, <laughs> if that is even a thing. So even if I was betrayed or lied to, I always believed they had a good reason for it. That's what I always believed, all because I was too scared to admit it. The Kazuichi I know is a confident, happy-go-lucky guy who gets a little carried away sometimes. But maybe he's just been pretending to be like that. When I was in middle school, there was this guy I thought was my best friend. We always did everything together, and I could talk to him about anything. 
But one time, I let him cheat off my test because he begged me for help. But we got caught. Till the very end, he insisted that I was the one who willingly gave him the answers. But as long as he didn't get punished, I really didn't mind sharing my answers with him at all. Ah. Uh -huh. But ever since that happened, he kept avoiding me. I wonder why. It's not like I really cared. Maybe he felt guilty. He probably couldn't stand it. Yeah. Now that I'm older, I feel like I understand him a little. But at the same, but at the time, I was fed up with everything, so I decided to get rid of all of it, including my looks. And when that happened, everyone who used to hang around me started keeping their distance. And punk asses started getting closer to me instead. Since then, I haven't needed to believe in anyone, and I haven't been betrayed. <laughs> it was really easy. You'd be surprised how much changes when you change your appearance. Oh, Mitchell, you can have him back now. Oh, swap. Right. Swapsies. Hot girls kept coming on to me too, but to tell you the truth, that scared me a little. Kazuichi, I never felt betrayed by you. I mean, you always believed in me, didn't you? Uh, that got to a whole bunch oh. of times when he was like, Oh my god, you did it! You're the murderer! <laughs> <laughs> well... But after hearing your reasons, I think it's fine. So how about this? If you ever betray us and make us sad, I'll punch you as hard as I can. Got it? Huh? Bring it on. I'll make you eat those words. <laughs> Thanks. Because of you, I understand now. What I really hated all along wasn't being betrayed. I hated myself for being too weak to believe in others. Whatever happened... Whatever happens, I'll believe in you. <laughs> that is what being friends is all about. Let's definitely get out of here. All of us. Yeah, definitely. Kazuichi offered his hand and I gripped it firmly. This time, I felt a strong, definite bond forming between Kazuichi and me. And I... But it'll be different if you act suspicious. Even if you are my friend, I doubt you... I'll doubt you if you are... If you're suspicious. Great, thanks. I can't wait to get your panties. Yeah. <laughs> uh, we have a line read. Uh, contacts? Is your ass implants? Do you stuff your bulge too? Soda. Fucking, I'm going back to being a pervert comedy buddy. Can't be vulnerable for a fucking <laughs> second on this island. Aw. <laughs> uh, you unlock the skill craft work. Oh my god, his panties are adorable. So pretty. Let's see what they are. They're so colorful. Bop, bop, bop to the Panties. Panties. So, 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 Kazuichi's favorite trunks, a popular brand among mechanical men due to its repair the now, create the now ad campaign. That kind of feeling shines through the colorful design. Lovely. I would wear those. Nah. Oh, totally, uh. I mean, that was it, really. Have, yep, after starting uh, the ski. Sneak an M&M. Oh, that's oh, right. Oh, oh, oh. Part of ways and return to oh. the cottage. Oh, okay. Well, I guess we'll go and start the next one. All right. Eat your M&Ms. Mm, where you go? Yum, 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 yum. Oh, other way. Where are you, shorty? Oh, God, he looks like... Oh, my God, look at what a monster creature doggy dog looks like next to him. <laughs> <laughs> All right. How much longer do we have to stay in this place? I feel like it's going to make me rot to death. <laughs> But still, I guess talking to someone ain't so bad. No, oh, I'm gonna blush a little bit, see? Uh, you see? <laughs> yes, see? I spent time talking to... Uh, today, talking to Fihiko. We have a line read. <laughs> <laughs> it's a good one, too. I was just looking at it. Uh, so, yeah, uh, you start that one. I need you to hit me. Uh, your eyes make me weak in the knees, and I get lighthearted about... Lightheaded thinking about your teeth sinking into my... I said hit me, not hit on me. 
<laughs> Very important distinction. <laughs> I spent time today talking to Fihiko. Looks like Fihiko and I grew a little closer. Look at his little pout. Next to his, like, doll baby eyes, it's like, wow. <laughs> what are you doing? Hmm. Oh, let me look up Fuyuhiko. Fuyuhiko. Free time. Give me a little chaos. Give me a little chaos. Ah, uh, he likes 71 antique doll. What? Really? <laughs> Apparently, and he likes, he only likes two things, so I'll tell you what the other one is, because I don't know if we have it. 81 Stardust? No, we have these antique dolls. Oh, okay, dolls. so we'll give him antique dolls, and when we run out, we'll have to look at the sort of like list. <laughs> Boss Baby looking ass? He does look like Boss Baby! The, this is an item that's rare as impossible to snag, no matter how many strings you pull. <laughs> this is my favorite Cabbage Patch Kit. Thanks, Hajime. The name of the Kuzuryu clan? I definitely owe you one. That is the old- This is the happiest I've ever seen him! He likes dolls. He likes baby dolls because they look like him. <laughs> hey, Fuyuhiko, how's that wound on your stomach doing? Hey, Fuyuhiko, how's that wound on your stomach doing? Huh? <laughs> <laughs> Watch- Fuck. <laughs> 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 Who was that just now? I don't know. <laughs> an Anyways, echo. it's fine. Nothing to worry about. I thought you'd say that. Oh, were we only ever able to hang out with him after he got stabbed? Yeah. Huh. You must have abnormally strong willpower to actually slice open your own stomach like oh, that. Oh, no, that's when he stabbed himself. Then again, you are the ultimate Yakuza. This is weird <laughs> to talk about when he doesn't even have the eye patch on yeah. right now. Yeah. And it's weird to see him with both eyes. Huh. I just have Yakuza blood flowing in my veins. There's nothing strong about that. You know, I did some thinking about this when I was in the hospital. Like, maybe this is all a dream. A dream, huh? How great would that be? Oh, uh, no. we are very close to the truth. <laughs> Sorry. Obviously, you'd be thinking about it more than I would. Yeah. That's not true. Fuck you. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I've seen plenty of people die up till now. And as long as I'm burdened with the Kuzuryu name, I'll always be dealing with a mountain of bodies. But you guys aren't like me. It's a sick joke to see students who live honest lives bumping each other off like this. This guy has always known violence and death. I see. He's used to it. Are you scared to talk to me? Huh? There's no need to hide it. I'm used to being treated with caution by everyone. The world is a barbaric place, especially my world. I have cute little freckles. <laughs> everyone I know tries to settle things. <laughs> I look like I was drawn Sorry. from Tumblr. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I was invented by the Tumblr girls. Settle things with violence. You guys have different values than I do. <laughs> My old man likes to say predators are always stronger than their prey. Well, I mean, no fucking Yeah, that's, yeah that's not a, that's <laughs> that's not a, a secret. That's a really <laughs> stupid saying. I could have gone on Google and told you that. He's a hothead. Even if it's just a minor argument, he'll come at you with everything he's got. He sounds like a real jackass. And when him and my mom fight, she seriously tries to kill him. And being a Yakuza means you can even kill the man you love to get your point across. <laughs> My parents are divorced now. <laughs> I've been hearing stuff like that since before I was old enough to understand what's going on around me. And now I have my stepfather, Darren. <laughs> He's cool, I guess. Yeah, yeah. That, he... That's a pretty... I'm sorry, go ahead. That's a pretty... <laughs> Tell me about Darren. Outrageous. Yeah, I was gonna say Darren works at the... Oh, that's fucking Hajime, I'm yeah, sorry. <laughs> that's, uh, I like the idea that Darren's like a general manager at like a McDonald's or something like that. Like, yeah. it's a normal ass life. <laughs> He's like a really regular guy. <laughs> yeah. It's a pretty outrageous home life. The worlds we both live in couldn't be more different. Suga. There were a few times where I nearly got killed in the aftermath of my parents' fights. Oh, that's just... God, man. But whenever something like that happened, Pekka was always there by my side. Uh, I'm sorry. I made you remember something painful. Huh? What? You don't need to apologize for that, you strange bastard. Fuck you. 
But still, I'm the rightful successor of the Kuzurio clan. I don't get overwhelmed very easily. I'm just waiting to say fuck you at the end of every one of these lines. <laughs> ah, you never know when it's coming. <laughs> By the time I was in the second grade, I didn't cry even if I lost a fight. I, I see. G good for you. Fuck you. Good for me? <laughs> Good for me? <laughs> don't treat me like a kid. Fuck you. I don't really know what else to say to him. <laughs> Fuck you. <laughs> I'll say it after all of your voice lines. Fuck uh, you. <laughs> anyway, it's not much. I'm starting to get to know Fuyuhiko a little better. That's his first interaction. Yeah, it's interesting. After talking to Fuyuhiko about some other things, I parted ways with him and returned to my room. Trying to remember that we have to build Usami a fucking robot. I know. I kind of want to see it, but I don't really want to build it. <laughs> I don't think we ever get to see the item we make. No, we don't. Okay, we've got a few things. Ah! I feel so pumped that I could probably make like a hundred songs! Alright. Um, Ego says, I'm looking through Nagito's wiki, and the trivia section says, Nagito seems to be attracted to people of the same gender. Like, no shit. <laughs> that sounds like, like... I don't know, like, is that true, or is that something somebody really wants to be true that they put in the wiki? <laughs> um, and we got a line read. Ah, oh, Jimmy. Hey, Kuzuri, remember when you stabbed yourself? No. What the fuck are you talking about? Fuck you. <laughs> you also have one. <laughs> you said I'm a- Fuck you, I'm topping. <laughs> Ibuki seems pretty, uh, feeling pretty good. It's good, yeah. She's crying, and she's also- Barfing like straight out of her mouth. You want me to build you a fucking robot? Fuck you. And... Oh, they have evidence for the trivia. We... Uh, I, I mean, I believe it. I wait, believe it. Wait, 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 wait. We only have. Oh no, Genguro. Somehow, some way, we're too short. Oh no! Well, I don't think there was. A, I think from the beginning we didn't have enough yeah. days. I mean, yeah. we just start. Yeah. I mean, assumedly, we, we'll see. We'll see. View <laughs> Hiko ending sentences with "fuck you" is like a cat boy who ends the sentences with "yeah." <laughs> Love that. <laughs> Aw, Tiagi's the only one. She has a little sleepy day. Mm. Why does Akane have like a little tiny dinky baby shovel? <laughs> Interesting. La la. Hmm. <laughs> oh, this. Oh, it's you. All right. <laughs> I almost wonder, are we too off because we did those um, tickets with Terra Terra? Uh, and, uh, yeah, probably because we weren't able to earn fragments that way. But I thought we were off before that. Like, we did the math and we were off. We might have been. It's all good. I don't remember. <laughs> yeah, let's just give him something. So he Give me another doll, bitch. Damn. Yeah, I want, I want that American Girl doll. Okay. I don't remember what number it was. D 40 something I thought, but let me double check. It's 71, I don't know where I got 40. Excuse me. Oh. I love dolls. Yes. Hajime, I'll never forget this favor. Oh. Hey, Hajime. <laughs> Fuck you. Ah, never mind, it's nothing. <laughs> Damn it, huh? <laughs> now I want to know. <coughs> Are we going to watch the anime or not? Um, I have no plans on it. Not at this moment. I I yeah. intend to, but not anytime soon. Mm -hmm. I've seen like bits and pieces, like through gifs and stuff, but I, so I'm interested. But I've got a lot of other um, anime lined up that I need to see first. Uh, like a like a well, man made of chainsaws. I, uh, yeah, that's on that's on my list actually. You and me should watch that together, so I'll actually watch it. Because if I'm left to my own devices, I'll keep watching like shoujo romance until the day I die. <laughs> what are you talking about? Chainsaw Man's <laughs> shoujo romance. <laughs> Is it a shoujo romance? No. All right. 
What are you laughing at me for? I say GIF, does it matter? <laughs> well, what? Mind your own business. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck you. Fuck you. <laughs> awesome. <laughs> I'm just, you know, looking for something. I mean, shut the fuck up! It's not like I'm looking for anything, baka! He seems strangely on edge. Damn it, if I just had that, I wouldn't feel so pissed off. But someone's always at the supermarket, so I can't just calm down and go look for it. Shit, I feel like I'm gonna go through withdrawal or something. It's starting to sound a little dangerous, but what's this? But what's this? What? What's this? What's this? <laughs> but this means there's something he wants, right? Why in the world is Fuyu Hiko looking for something sweet? Mm -hmm. I got a sweet tooth, see? I got a sweet tooth, <laughs> and I can only and only and, and only white chocolate is the thing that will satiate my oh, hunger. Too, too sweet. Too, too sweet. sweet. I'm very sure this is wrong, but do you want to eat something sweet? Ha! How, how do you know that? Fuck! Heroin addict Fuyuhiko? <laughs> what? Oh, it's you. <laughs> I, need, uh, I need the devil sugar. <laughs> what? I seriously got that right? <clears throat> if you tell anyone about that, I'm gonna bury you next to that mountain over there. That's Mount Dumpling over there. See? <laughs> the classic, iconic Mount Dumpling. <laughs> Ego says, white chocolate's only good if you get a really good brand. The only time I like white chocolate is when it's white chocolate Reese's. And it's only if it's like a special shaped one. Like Valentine's Day is coming up. I suck down those like pink white chocolate hearts. Fuck. So good. It actually <laughs> will kill me someday. <laughs> I love those. Um, I like the little like uh, Lindor chocolates. Oh. You ever have those? Are they good? Are they good as white chocolate? I've never had a white chocolate one. I really like them. They have like this interesting wow. strawberry mix. That, like it's interesting that like tabs and I will grab during Valentine's Day. Oh hell yeah, that does sound good. You, you I like don't have to be... if it's like with stuff. Ah, uh, yeah, I feel that. You don't have to be so oh, angry. I'm gang. Don't tell me what to do. Fuck you. <laughs> <laughs> I, I like sweet things too. Uh, uh, sweet things calm your nerves and also don't alienate our audience, gang. <laughs> they also I'm gonna tell everybody, fuck you, but I do love you guys. I love you all. I'll give you kisses if I could. Mwah. They also nourish Insane. your brain. <laughs> Insane in the membrane. Insane in the brain. So it's not a thing to be embarrassed about. <laughs> Thank you for the clip, mirror. Oh my god, we're seeing so many different Fuyuhiko faces. Look at all of these. Yeah, these are things we've never seen before. I know, this is so cute. I he's blushing. But but still. It'd be embarrassing if anyone knew that the heir to the Kuzuryu clan likes eating fried dough cookies. Fried like, dough cookies. I like fried dough cookies. I'm looking it up real quick. Yeah, what the hell is fried dough cookies? That sounds amazing. Let me, let me see. Fried dough cookies. I'll look it up too. I wanted to make cookies this weekend. Maybe I'll make fried dough cookies. Oh my god, those look amazing. Oh my god. I'm gonna, I'll, I'll post like a picture on. on oh, I'm looking at fried soon. cookie dough bites, but fried rosette snowflake cookies with confection sugar. No, like, I, I also looked at the exact same fried cookie dough bites. Yeah. Yeah, those look like, they look like um, donut holes a little bit, but like lighter or something. Looks amazing. Yeah, it looks like, it looks like uh, that's right. pretty much the gimmick of those. Love oh, that. hang on. Gangudo Thin Mint Fried Cookie Dough Bites. No. The, the, oh, we missed a, we missed a um, line read by Mirror oh, shit. earlier. We'll have to go back yeah, for yeah. it. Sorry, Mirror. What? Thin Mint... What? Thin Mint Cookie Dough Bites. They, they look green in the middle. I'll post them in Media Museum so you can take a look at them. Okay. Cookie... Bites, you said? Yeah, look at that. Oh, I can just look at medium. Me medi medium museum. It just takes me a while to do things. Chunk of mint take, or no, chunks of mint take this deep fried cookie dough to the next level. That's fun. Wow, that looks amazing. Kronzen, did you make that comic? <laughs> that you posted in there? Because it's really adorable. <laughs> All right. <laughs> let's, let's, let's get back to it. Sorry, sorry. We have to get back to it. I like fried. Well, yeah, we told ourselves we'd fucking finish today, didn't we? Yeah, I like fried uh -oh. dough cookies too. They taste great when you eat them with milk. Hey, 
Hey, you bastard! <laughs> Never, ever say that again. Huh? Fried dough cookies? No, the other one. Oh, mi- you don't make me sippy this milk. Didn't you hear what I just said? I'll seriously fucking bury you. This is bad. His eyes Poor look mother real in intense. the other room. I've never seen anyone get so mad over milk. Don't cry over <gasps> spilled milk. Well, I'll fucking kill you over it. Damn it! If only my guts were stronger, even I could have. Oh, he's lactose intolerant. <laughs> Shit! I want to swallow it all in one gulp, you know. But with my height, what is it like talking? He really doesn't have to be so hostile towards the milk. There's other ways to get calcium. Maybe if he'd have drank more milk as a child, he'd be a little taller. Yeah. He wish he was a little bit taller. He wish he was a baller. He wish... <laughs> oh, no. I don't know if this is a good time to say something like that, though. Ah, you laughed, didn't you? I'm gonna cry. No, I, I didn't. No, you're definitely laughing. It doesn't show in your face, but I can tell you're laughing on the inside. Damn it. I won't let you forget this! Fujiko picked up his two uh, antique dolls and <laughs> 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 mumbled under his breath as he walked away in a hurry. Well, that was an unexpected side of Fujiko. <laughs> when he talks like that, it's like he's a completely normal guy for his age. In fact... Really? Are you sure? Oops. It might be a dangerous to even think about completing that thought. He seems a little younger. <laughs> Um, okay, we need to go back. Mir had a oh, line yes. for us. Mir has two. Hajime. Yes. All right, I can see what Kaiko sees in you now. Oh. Hajime. If a dangerous <laughs> person disagrees with me, I immediately change my views. Well, maybe you should have principles. You're right. Maybe I should. <laughs> nice. Uh, no, there was another one even farther back. Oh, is there? After the fuck you, I'm topping one, there was one with Usami. Oh, yeah. Uh, why aren't you all working on my army? Uh, I mean your school projects. Because we can't get the materials on time, you crazy I.I. -I. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Ple please get plenty of rest so you can do your very best again tomorrow. Freaking Soda's like, I wish I could build a rocket ship. She's giving you the opportunity to build a mecha robot, and yeah. we're not doing that. <laughs> oh, the island's so dirty. We need to clean. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> Thanks, Usami. I like and Saint Albo said, um, Dangam Ropa, but instead of Peko calling Fuhiko young master, she calls him baby girl. <laughs> I want a mod that like changes it every time. My baby girl. Oh, let's probably see what we can make real quick. Beep, 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 beep. Oh, we needed just ten. We needed ten of those, damn it. Oh. Alright, cool. <laughs> golden plates next. Mm-hmm. White cotton. Oh, you know, you have to collect white cotton, I think. Um, I might be at Nezumi Castle. Do you want me to double check? Yes, it is at Nezumi Castle. Mm-hmm. Fried dough cookies. Mm. Sounds amazing. I know, now I'm like wanting something sweet. I know. Well, I'm eating something sweet. I'm good. Oh, damn. Oh, but... hey, before I forget, do you want to watch High School Musical 2 after uh, yeah. the show tonight? Okay. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> we were what a silly thing to we, ask. We were trying to figure out what we wanted to watch tonight, and we were like, oh, maybe that. I'm gonna, um, after the show, because I'm still at my parents' house, I'm gonna, then I'll have to go to home. If you guys are okay with that, I don't yeah, want to keep yeah, you guys no, up fine. too late. Yeah. You know, no, no, so no, I'll, I'll fine, try. Fine. I'll get there as fast as yeah, I can. No, no, you're good. You're good. All right, that should be everyone at their assigned tasks. Ego says, that, "Is it a spoiler if I tell you about an ending song part of the anime? I feel like it's obscured enough not to be that spoilery." Uh, sure. I think. I mean, I'm okay with that. Are you okay? Yeah. With that. Yeah, All right. Unless, unless, okay. Let's, Go for broke, Ego. Unless, I mean, like, how could it be spoilery when we know it's gonna happen in the anime, right? Yeah, you're right. I assume. I don't know. If it's obscure, I, I trust your judgment, Ego. La la la. Let's go meet with someone. Who should we talk to? I don't know. 
Just kidding, I know. <laughs> like, right. seriously, look at look at Fuhiko right next to Nagido. Right. It's like his head is just way too small. <laughs> or Nagido's head is too big. So good. That could be. All right, what else does he like? Oh, um, all right. Now that we don't have any of the things he loves, so we have to get something he just kind of likes. What about number seven? Non-alcoholic wine. Not. Nope. 20, Iroha t-shirt, Edel Hop. Nope. 23, Falcor, Falcor's muffler. Okay. Did we have it? Yep. Yay. I don't really want to owe you any favors. <laughs> well, you probably won't pose a threat later, so I'll just gratefully accept it. Know. You know, like a normal person would. <laughs> hey, Hajime, is there any woman who's important to you? What kind of question is hey. that? Well, goddamn, it's just a regular fucking question. Don't act so defensive. Sorry, I was looking at um, I was looking at his his thingy. <laughs> we walk up to Fihuko, Fihuko's like, do you ever think about what your funeral's gonna be like? <laughs> what kind of gravestone would you like after I fucking bury you? <laughs> would you want cre cremation or 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 casket? <laughs> I probably wouldn't be cremated just because I don't want to have to. Don't spend money on a funeral for me. Just burn my ass. Actually, donate me to science. It'd be funnier. Mm. It's fine. Do you have one or not? Um, honestly, I've never seriously thought about it. Heh, <laughs> <laughs> you're such a kid. <laughs> I don't have one wire. You're just like, <laughs> donate me to science. And I imagine, like, they're like, alright, now we're gonna fling this person up as high as we can <laughs> and see how- and see the- <laughs> like, 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 it's, like, it's not like even terminal like... velocity. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Like it's not it's not like uh it's not like we don't need like like this is science technically. And like and the <laughs> I mean, yeah. I wouldn't want it to go any other way. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, Tech says they want to be turned into a gem with their ashes, like like have their ashes super compressed into a gem, passed down through the future generations. I'd feel a little weird if, if my mom was like, Here's a beautiful necklace and I'd be like, Oh, thank you and they're like, It's made from your great great grandmother <laughs> Be like, oh, okay. <laughs> but so cool. I've thought about doing that with um with my cat, but you know, then which of which of us would get to have the the dead cat necklace? <laughs> if you did have one, I was gonna tell you to take good care of her, but I guess it's a bit too soon for you. <laughs> but when you do have one someday, make sure you take good care of her. Don't be like me. I I've lost two important women. Oh yeah. Peko committed her crime because his little sister was killed. Huh? Whoa there, don't feel sorry for me, partner. It's not like I want to make this awkward. <laughs> but if my sister were still alive, I'd really want you guys to meet her. Oh. You'd probably be shocked. If you put it like that, she must have been one hell of a sister. Didn't Whatever that means. Do you know what my sister's ultimate talent was? <laughs> Who measures this? <laughs> she was the ultimate little sister. Isn't that funny? The ultimate little sister? How was she an awesome little sister? It's hard to put into words, exactly. Anyway, she was definitely an amazing sister. Like, how can she apply that to, like, her future? <laughs> you know, like, to the world. Japan is like, we need this. <laughs> she was always making a fool out of me, but it was always cute when she'd need my help. <laughs> She was the ultimate trope, like, what the fuck? I don't know why, I just imagine, like, other weird, like, ultimates. Like, this one was the ult- Like, oh, what's your name? Uh, my name is, uh, Jody, and, uh, I am the ultimate diarrhea master. <laughs> Alright, can, um- I don't know why I thought you were gonna say I am the ultimate <laughs> diarrhea master. <laughs> That's just hit me for some reason. I, just... I was so delayed! <laughs> you were just saying my name is Josie, <laughs> I'm the ultimate pussycat. Like Okay. Like what? Like what? <laughs> like there's a panel of people and here comes the guy, he looks like a totally normal dude, and he's just like, yeah. Yeah, my sphincter produces nothing but diarrhea. <laughs> I've never pooped anything else. 
That's a, the, one of the guys takes off his glasses and he's like, what power? <laughs> <laughs> Mirror says Sonya's the ultimate princess, so they can excuse the ultimate little sister. But like, you could actually do something being the ultimate princess. <laughs> you lead a nation, or you will, I guess. Yeah. It's just so strange. Diego says we're gross. Yeah, that's fair. They love us. Thank you. <laughs> that's fair. I understand. <laughs> Yeah, I, I get it. <laughs> this is this is why we're this is why we're uh, we're at like the top of the C tier streamers. <laughs> we're a king amongst dogs, and I'd rather be a king amongst dogs than a dog amongst kings. We're the ultimate king amongst dogs. <laughs> <laughs> dog king. <laughs> I love this. No, right, I'm sorry. She, oh, she was cute when she needed my help. I, I knew that one. Uh, oh, there was another. Uh, oh, uh, fun fact. fact. Yeah, I'll go. go. I'm gonna say it in in the free. Yeah, yeah. Fun yeah. fact about Nagido: the ending song for Danganronpa Three Despair Arc, performed by Megumi Ogata as Nagido, is about the birth of absolute hope and Nagido meeting someone he was born to meet in the middle of the night at the school's campus. The song has sexual implications, especially in the Japanese wording, which is confirmed by Ogata. Wonder who the hell that was. <laughs> 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 it's Hajime. Anyway. <laughs> awesome. Thank you for the facts, Ego. What was fun? I love Nagi. I, I like the idea of the songwriters in a room and it's like, what did you mean by the, the lyric choice tickle the sack? <laughs> <laughs> I had to put my M and M down because I knew I was just not gonna be able to do that. <laughs> I put the <laughs> That just like came out of you. Like like you had no time to prepare that. Why do you say things like that? Like the songwriter is just like I wanted the song to have like a deep and meaning beautiful <laughs> meaning. <laughs> the deep meaning with sexual <laughs> What exactly did you mean by that? <laughs> <laughs> what could they mean? I just don't know. <laughs> Maybe he meant to tickle the sack of my heart. <laughs> the, the heart sack, you know, uh, yeah. that everyone has. <laughs> oh my god, I'm like feeling dizzy. <laughs> the classic heart sack. Iconic, really. <laughs> okay. Uh, smiling hurts now. <laughs> <laughs> okay. okay. <laughs> we'll get that line read after yeah, this. Yeah, we gotta, we gotta finish it. This, we gotta finish um, it. Yeah. Plus, if she cooked fried noodles during the temple festival, a huge line would form outside the temple. This is a lot of <laughs> random facts. And she got an insane number of contracts from hand towel companies, you know? What? She was self-centered, selfish, extremely arrogant. She was Hyoko. But even so, she had this subtle way of making people do what she wanted. She definitely deserved to be called the ultimate Yakuza. Well, wait. What? What? Within the clan, she was even called the reincarnation of my uncle, who was the most powerful of the Kuzuryus. The most powerful of the Kuzuryus? I'd like to know more about that, too. Well, fuck yeah. you, I'm not telling you. But before it's before my time, so I don't really know the details, but... Apparently, he was known as the... <laughs> Overlord of the South. They say his final confrontation with the detective who was pursuing him nearly destroyed the world. What? <laughs> it's a little bit of an exaggeration, but that's obviously just a rumor. Oh my god. That's so insane. Oh, like, okay. He's saying he de she deserved it more than him. Got it, got it. Of course, it's just a rumor. That'd be outrageous if it wasn't. Well, anyway, she was a really annoying little sister who pissed me off. But even so, she was the only little sister I ever had. Even when a faction within the Kazuryu clan wanted to make her our next leader, she said this. I don't want to lead the clan. The reason I'm so amazing is because I'm your sister. <laughs> <laughs> she said that even though she was better than me at everything. How did I become the ultimate Yakuza then? <laughs> to you, your sister must have truly been the ultimate little sister. <laughs> eh, maybe. <laughs> but still, when she said that to me, I couldn't accept it. <clears throat> All I could do is yell at her and say, You lead! I can live by myself! With Pekko. Just how small was I? Fuhiko. Heh. 
Why am I even talking to you about this? Huh? It's probably, you know, that harmless looking face of yours. I just want to grab it and kiss it all over. Uh, is that a compliment <laughs> or an insult? <laughs> <laughs> well, let these lips tell you. Who knows? <laughs> <Mwah>. <laughs> Fuck you. <laughs> Well, anyway, sorry about that. I guess I got all sentimental and shit after all. Which, which one are we on right now? Oh. I don't know. Oh, <laughs> I'll try to wrap it up since I know you still got to talk to Sonya. <laughs> I really don't mind. Oh, fuck. Just kill me now. <laughs> <laughs> Just kill me now. You... I, there was a lot of silence. I was like, he's either laughing no, or he no, thinks it's, it's my turn. It's super funny. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> I, just, I, just, I just love the concept of frustrated me. We've laughed more at Fuhiko today than anyone else. <laughs> yeah, right? He's fun. If, <laughs> if you think I look like someone who's easy to talk to, then I'll listen to you as much as you want. That is so sweet. <laughs> Don't act like hot shit, you... I see. So you're not? <laughs> yeah, Virgin, just shut up! Don't talk back to me so calmly! Even though Fuck it happened you. gradually, I know Fiyahiko was slowly opening up to me. <laughs> yeah, Virgin! Once again, I was able to understand Fiyahiko a little bit more. And then he, <laughs> and then he punched me in the dick. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus. Okay, we've got two liners. Oh, cool. After changing the subject and talking about other things for a while, I returned to my room. Okay. Uh, the first one is uh, Mirror Archives. Yes. Uh, fun fact about Nagido, he's a slut for you. Hajime, dry, dryly. Shocker, I had no idea. Uh, yeah, that's on the wiki. I put it there. <laughs> <laughs> um. Granzen, Hajime. <laughs> the most powerful of the ku, the ku ku, the kuru ru, the kusuru ru kuru. Are you having a fucking stroke? It's not that hard. I, 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 I you get it. Uh, Kamehameha. I'm gonna fucking strangle you. <laughs> Fuck you. God damn, you virgin. When you wrote this song and you were going through the lyrics, what did you mean <laughs> by the phrase, I want the, <laughs> the moon to ram me as hard as the sun does? <laughs> Are those actual lyrics to something or did you just make no, them up? Oh, no, I made them up. Oh, amazing. <laughs> What did you mean by <laughs> God, I want him to fuck me so bad just in all of the holes? What did you mean by that? When you wrote the phrase, and he like puts on like mess. a small pair of glasses and like lifts up like the... The like half spectacles. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God. Thank you for all the clips, Mir. I can't wait to see them later. I want the lunar sprinkles all over my face and chest. When I have this, <laughs> when I have it all over me, I know that he's the best. <laughs> what, and then like he, he like takes his glasses like slightly <laughs> off and like looks at him like well you know i was trying to go for subtle ideas of <laughs> <laughs> i'm sorry where was the subtlety <laughs> <laughs> oh man i'm like lightheaded stop with the laughter oh, i like so... don't laugh all week and then like he's <laughs> <and> <laughs> I don't even crack a fucking smile all week. Then I come here and it all comes out. Oh my god. <laughs> Everyone, good night time. May the plenty of rest. <laughs> <laughs> you did a bad event to get the photo. Good night. <laughs> Sorry if I've blown out anybody's eardrums <laughs> laughing tonight. Uh, you're cool. <laughs> uh. <laughs> and he seems to be having a yeah, good fucking was... time. We have four days left to make a fucking back. Four days left. I hope you guys are working on a nice tutorial. Uh, nothing, nothing is funnier than watching Fuyuhiko just dead on the ground. <laughs> <laughs> we should put him in bed. Oh, God. There's so many dead people. <laughs> Hang on. It's... <laughs> Mir has, a, has one for you, Mitchell. <laughs> oh, God. Uh, okay, you're not allowed to smile until we stream on Tuesday and Thursday. You get two less peaches. Oh, no. I'm so, like, low on peaches. Oh, no. I'm bleeding. I cut my finger on a can today. Oh. Did you? Yeah, li uh, just a little bit. Okay. But annoying enough that, like, when I touch anything, it's like, oh, fuck. 
like oh, a paper cut, dude, cut but like yeah. one with blood. Golden plate. We need gold for that. Where's three? Yeah, I would think. Sorry. I think that's in the mountains. Yeah, let's go to the mountains yeah. then. Let's all go to the mountains. It's Candy Mountain. Fuck me. Never mind. <laughs> do it. Do it. Do it. Yeah. All right. Let's go. All right. All right. Here we go. Oh, we got some gold. Jabiman. <laughs> Jabiman. <laughs> Jabimerald. <laughs> I love these. Oh, yes. We're getting the gold, baby. Hell yeah. How much do we need? We've killed two people. <laughs> oh, no. We must not have looked. The mountain must have been a high, high evil area. Oh. My stamina is already at my limit. What happened to the love? I don't think I can handle this much longer. Hey, 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 hey! They're fucking, fucking dead! Oh, God. That's okay. Oh, Hajime. Um, <laughs> when you sang at the school talent show, yeah, I want to suck his dick until his soul comes out of his body, <laughs> what did you mean? It's about hope! <laughs> I love it. Gang, actually, I wanted to ask you this before we get super deep into Fleet Eco, just like in the song. Okay. Um, yeah. <laughs> what? what is, is there any voices you think you're going to end up... Re like, I always pick one or two voices that I end up recycling later on in uh, other things. I tend to... I feel like I've used Hyoko's voice in other things. Like, she's just a very general, like, mean, bratty girl voice for me. <laughs> um... But others that I might recycle. Like not, um, definitely yeah. not like like. Thing, I, I guess the, it would be better to say which ones do you think like were some of the like the ones that you feel like you would take into the next thing. Like mm. that were good enough for me. Like I like I had brought soda. Obviously, was what I used for Ryuji. Oh yeah. yeah. Uh, and you use Gundam for, uh... Narration My now. Mortal, yeah. yeah. And most narration things. Uh, yeah, I, I feel like definitely Hyoko, um, is, is like, an all-encompassing mean kid voice that I tend to use. In fact, I, I feel like I actually summoned Morgana a little bit for that. Mm. Um, uh, but, like, with a nasty little spin. Um, I don't really... I'd love to use Usami's voice for more things. <laughs> She's uh, she was just really fun to do because it was so like, um, loud. I guess like, oh, that's it, and it felt good on my throat. Like any of the voices that felt like good to do, Hiyoko's and Usami's definitely. Um, I'd do more. Oh, uh, you want me to look more for things? Yeah, I totally realized we didn't have any more. The yeah, sorry. Uh, thirty Valder's gold. <laughs> Ding dong. <laughs> I don't want to owe you any favors, uh. see? I'll have to give you a blowy behind the supermarket, <laughs> see? Is that, is that the adult version of Bluey? What? <laughs> Stop! <laughs> we we're putting it into this. We don't talk about adult version of anything when it comes to Bluey. <laughs> it's so fucking funny. It's funny, though. <laughs> Hilarious. <laughs> you got me there. <laughs> <laughs> Just you going, stop. <laughs> stop. <laughs> it ends here. It ends tonight. <laughs> Dark evil ends tonight. Um, hey, Hajime. What's the first thing you want to do when you get out of here? Hmm, let's see. Uh, every single chick I can find. Ha. Yeah, it's a ha. terrible joke. Yeah, that's real wishful thinking, isn't uh, it? <laughs> it's a terrible joke from like 13 years ago. 13 hmm. years ago. 13 years ago. He like like fucking like fades out of existence. Hmm, let's see. First, I want to find a safe place to relax and get some decent sleep. That's a boring ass wish. That sounds great to me. I'll join you. Jeez, compared to this place, I'd rather stay at a prison. That's an odd comparison. I've done time, Hajime. <laughs> at least this place <laughs> has soft beds, a beautiful ocean, and entertainment. Eh, you're right. What about you? What are you gonna do? What uh... Me? First, I'm going to visit my sister's grave. Way to bring down the fucking conversation. Ugh. I also need to hold a funeral for Pekko, even though there's nothing left of her. 
And for Mahiru as well. Because that was my fucking fault. I see. You're right. <clears throat> Excuse me. Hey, Hajime. Hey, Hajime. <laughs> I think you're pretty awesome, you know? When it comes to me and the others, at least we know where our confidence is coming from. Oh, jeez. But you. That part of you is missing. <laughs> what the fuck? But despite that, you don't let it get to you. You've kept a cool head throughout this, throughout all this so far. You're giving me way too much credit. I I'm just trying to endure everything the best that I can. That's what I'm talking about. It's amazing enough that you're even able to endure all this. I blindly rushed into revenge, without thinking things through, with no concern for anything else. And in the end, I can't take back the consequences of that decision. But after seeing you and the others keep it together, I feel like I'm starting to see what I need to be focusing on right now. We will definitely survive and escape from here. And I'll do anything to make that happen. Even kill. <laughs> if not Pekko, Mahiru, everyone's death will all go to waste. And that's when I realized. This wasn't the same Vihiko Kazuru I met when we first arrived at Silent. This is a man who has overcome great hardships. What can I do from now on? I still don't know. But I do know what I can say right now. Vihiko, let's definitely escape this island, okay? And when we do, would it be alright if we visited their graves together? Oh. Aw. Huh? <laughs> yeah, I'm sure that would make them happy. Oi, Kura. And Hajime, that part of you may be missing, but I think there's still something there. Because I was able to talk to you like this, and I was able to reflect on my past. And from there, I'm able to move forward. That's it. Maybe your talent is that you're the ultimate counselor. What the heck? <laughs> I don't have a talent like that. That sounds like it'd be <laughs> stressful. You don't know. Oh, look at my laugh. Oh, I'm so cute. <laughs> I think it's totally perfect for you. I have one giant tooth. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's really good. a bite out of a loaf of bread and it's like watching a knife slice into it <laughs> uh, it's like i'm a pokemon or something this is just not normal <laughs> our somber, oh, i gotta see a dentist our somber conversation took an unexpected lighthearted turn and then i screamed i had to hold my scream in after watching his giant tooth <laughs> we laughed harder than ever. that's why i never smiled <laughs> I thought I thought fucking Soda's teeth was fair. It's scary, scary. <laughs> yeah, this is way worse. <laughs> we laughed harder than we had in a while. <clears throat> oh, we have. Alright, we have like we have like three line reads. Oh. Fuck. Well, like two, but I wanted to read text too. Oh, okay, okay. Um, mirror. <clears throat> There's only two people I would kiss on this island, but I won't say who. Is it Pekko and Hajime? Yeah, it's Pekko and Hajime. Yeah. <laughs> Hey, Ajime, you're a normie. How are you able to hang with us cool dudes? <laughs> so mean. <laughs> That's you. Why do you keep saying that Pekko is dead? She's right there. Shut up. Fuck you. Jesus. <laughs> Mir says, oh god, I can't give you a single tooth and how it's horrifying. What, what Pokemon did that remind me of? That was Scatterbug? Is that what it was called? Mm, no, I think yeah, Scatter it's got one big gross tooth. I, th I thought Scatterbug was a move. No, no, no. You're... No, Scatterbug's a Pokemon, and it looks like, like, I'll put it in the, I'll put it in the, um, in the Discord yeah. somewhere. Um, I part ways with Vihiko and return to my room for now. Scatterbug. Yeah, Don't do that, computer. Jesus. Paste. This is for Vihiko. Right, let me see. Vihiko. Ooh, I wrote Hikpo. Oh! <laughs> my bad. That's what Fuhiko looks like in my brain now. Everyone, it's a good night time. Pick up and <laughs> Everyone, it's a good night. And a good night, everyone. A sleepy tight. Sleepy, I love sleepy. you. Sleepy, sleepy. Pee 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 pee. Good night. <laughs> Don't pee pee. Pachirisu, too. I'll put Pachirisu in there, too. 
<laughs> Alright, I think there's some items we have that can actually bring people back from the dead. Nice. Wait, are they dead? Like, dead dead? No. Nah. Or do they just have to rest that one day? Beep, beep, boop, beep, 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 there's a lot of beeps going on. <laughs> okay, Jack, yes. I'm sorry, I spelled it Beepo. I didn't mean to. Beepo. You are truly not allowed to make any kind of spelling mistake in a Discord chat. No, you're not. There we go. <laughs> Gotta really patch your Risu. <laughs> yeah. There you go. <laughs> are you seeing Akane's blanket? She's got two huge boobs under the cover. <laughs> That's about right. <laughs> That's amazing. Every time I look at these little sprites, I notice something different. Oh, bye, Ego. I, I, I love you. Go take that shower, boo. Go, yeah, go take the shower and think more about like those like uh, lyrics. Yeah, try not to think about for you. He goes one big tooth coming at you from behind, sinking into your shoulder. Like one single vampire fang. That's okay. dull. Um. <laughs> uh, <laughs> They're dead, and Usami is going to get uploaded into their bodies. Thank you for the horror, Shrinkman. <laughs> uh, what's another thing that he likes? <laughs> is he out of, uh, try 32, Silver Ring? <laughs> so you're trying to suck up to me. I thought that suck, <laughs> suck up on me. Yeah. Do you really think I take bribes? Well, well, it's fine if I accept this from you. <laughs> I don't know. Hey, Ajime, there's something I need to talk to you about. Come here. Hey, come here. This seems closer. more serious than usual. What's going on? Closer. I followed Seriously. Fuyuhiko until we come arrived. Come with a tooth ring. <laughs> <laughs> I followed Fuyuhiko until we arrived at the cottage. Oh, you're in my room now. <laughs> Yo, wait there. I got something from the supermarket for you. <laughs> it's called a kiss. Hershey kiss. What are you, crazy? <laughs> I'm sorry. Hold on a minute. I have to bring the chat back up. Oh, here it is. <laughs> Excuse me. Here it is. Oh, there it is. I thought, you, meant, yeah, I thought you were talking about the, the, the chat. <laughs> the chat. Yeah, I, I understand. It was an easy mistake to make. He slammed a 60-ounce bottle and a glass right in front of me. Is this alcohol? Shot, 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 shot. Nah, it's just water. Huh? Listen up. Underage drinking is not allowed under any circumstances. Let me tell you, the smell's enough to make me pass out. I advise you not to go within 300 feet of the stuff. Don't be absurd. <laughs> Regardless, I just wouldn't feel right with only a plastic bottle. Come on. Take it. I'll take the <laughs> glass, but I have no idea what the heck Anyways. is going on. Um, this is probably... Is this a Brotherhood Cup? It's Brotherhood Cup. Did you be talking about a Brotherhood Cup? <laughs> this is the last few he cup. Well, what? You don't want to? No, it, it's nothing like that. I just honestly never thought anything like this would ever happen to me. What, do you not like the <laughs> indirect kiss trope? <laughs> Obviously. Don't think about it too much. There is This isn't about making us real brothers or anything. It's either It's either a giant tooth or a light in his mouth. Uh, yeah, like on the roof of his mouth, yeah, he's got like a, like a little, a like, little, yeah. I get what you mean. Like one of those touch pads, like he like pushes the inside of it and uh, lights up. Yeah. 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 I'll illuminate the cavern of my mouth so you can see my tongue. Blah, blah, blah. <laughs> I really want to be a tongue puppet performer. Put, put my yeah. put my outfits on my tongue and they have them perform mu musicals. Wow, what a horrible <laughs> concept. <laughs> Hate that. Make them laugh, make them laugh. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, my honey. Hello, my darling. <laughs> Hello, my ragtime gal. Uh. <laughs> All right. I said this line. Oh. See? Fuck you. I don't know. This is a promise to return alive together. Aw, oh, this one actually works out. I will never die. I mean, I've already died once. And Pekko already saved that life after all. <laughs> but you look the type who dies easily, you know? So I thought it'd be good if we made a promise like this. Hey, don't <laughs> say something so ominous. <laughs> what a dick. 
That's why I'm saying that I'll give you half of my life. I mean, you... Oh, you're my first friend. Peko didn't count for some reason. Even now, I'm still worried about whether I deserve to lead the clan. But I feel like that might change if I get out of here alive. So, Hajime, you better not die either. Fihiko, you... If you're unsure, then live and live on. Oh. Search persistently and keep looking for it. Right, Tex? Tex says, that sounds like a marriage proposal. <laughs> Half my life. I thought the same thing. And then, you should... You should be able to find it. Yeah, you're right. I'll definitely try to find it, too. <clears throat> I accepted the cup and swallowed the water in one gulp. Vihiko yeah, did the same and suddenly smashed the cup afterwards. <laughs> Some say shattering the cup is a bad omen, but I prefer it this way. I mean, if you break something, that means it can't be broken ever again. What? Oh, that's right. Do you want to be my underling when we get out of here? You mean like a little brother? That doesn't really feel right. Fine, then you can just be my bro. Oh. Well, anyway, we gotta give it our all and think of a way to get out of here. We just took a piece of the broken cup and put it in our pocket. I can feel a strong bond with Fuyuhiko. As long as I have this you bond- You bastard, this is glass! This is dangerous! <laughs> I will never give up. That's what I believe, and I cut myself on the glass on accident. Now here's my panties, bro. Oh, thank you. Oh, <laughs> do so. Ooh, uh, they are fancy. Yeah, I want to read about them. Can't wait. There. Let me do a quick tech out of line read. I'm afraid I can't kiss you. I'm saving myself for Pekko. I mean marriage. I mean, fuck you. Uh, there we go. Fuyuhiko's favorite underwear. Despite that, it doesn't seem like he wears them because he likes them. Apparently, he doesn't have strong feelings toward his underwear. Okay. <laughs> La, Mir, Mir has small. another one. <clears throat> Was it higher up? No, no, it's, it's, um, it's... Oh, got it, yeah. got it. I'm immortal. Uh, okay, Mafia Man, let's get you to bed. <laughs> okay, Grandma. Now, uh, Ego... And Ego had a... Oh, did you want to read this one? Yeah, sure, sure. Do it, do it. Wait, one more fun fact before I go. If you use trip tickets with Nagi <laughs> yeah. and go to the beach, if Hanjimis lets let's take our clothes off, uh, let's take off our clothes on the beach date, Nagido comments, does that mean you want to go into the ocean with me? I think that's a bad idea. There's lots of ways that could be dangerous, but I don't mind if you want us just if you just want to see me naked. <laughs> That's funny. After talking to Fuyuhiko for a while about various things, I returned to my room. You don't, you don't know. Well, there's another big. There's a. That's a big voice line here. Start us off, Mitchell. Sing. Why was there a ring in my drink? I want you to be mine. Take it or leave it. You know I'm in a poly relationship with pretty much everyone on the island, right? Let me be selfish. After Pekko died, I just... I want to be open about what I want. Who I want. Kusuryu, that's really sweet, but Pekko is standing like five feet away from us. Oh, she... Fuck! Oh, God! <laughs> Quit telling everyone I'm dead. <laughs> it's like I can still hear her voice, see? See? What a now? Na -na -na. Now I have to get into my Sonya voice. I forget how Sonya sounds. It's been a while. It's been a princess. Yeah. Oh, wait a prepare. I gotta put the squeeze on the fat lady, see? I gotta put a squeeze on, on Byakuya. I'm for you, Hiko, see? I mean, Byakuya, what the fuck? I'm actually amazed I didn't think of just doing that for a voice. What? I went SpongeBob before I went like... <laughs> well, we made the comparison and so the fate was sealed, <laughs> you know? Uh, so that is how it works half the time. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I didn't even think of that when I first got his voice. I, th I don't remember what it was, but it was like a... It wasn't really anything and it slowly devolved into that. I feel really bad for Akane having to use that dinky little trowel to dig up stuff. Well... Oh, it's... It's Sonya, never mind. Never mind. <laughs> Goodbye. Fuck 
you. <laughs> <laughs> I am truly happy that someone has casually walked up to me to speak to me. <laughs> this must be what it means to have a cla to have classmates. I am very touched. <laughs> then would you like to take a walk? I would like to view the ocean a bit more. I spent time today walking along the shore with Sonia. I probably don't deserve it, but it looks like Sonia and I grew a little closer. Would I like to give I'm, Sonia? I'm looking a her up now. Sonia, never mind gifts. Free time. Bingle, bingle. Yep. All right. Uh, number eleven. Google hook <laughs> kick. Nope. Number twenty-one. Brightly colored jeans. We got two of those. Hell yeah! Give her some jeans. Let me get a drink really quick. Yeah, yeah, go for it. Go for it. I'm gonna take a drink too from my now depleted uh, peach <laughs> coke, peach uh, diet coke. There we go. Delicious. Is it really all right for me to accept such a wonderful item? <laughs> Aw, thank you very much, Hajime. I am truly happy. Mm -hmm. I must say, this island is a truly wonderful place. Ikeke desu ne. The weather is calm and the sky is and the sea is blue. Truly a perfect resort setting. That might be true, but. Arara? Oh, did I say something strange? No, I was thinking that you're strangely calm right now. Sonia, are you not worried about our current situation? Watakushi wa. Of course I am worried, and I am also angry. Jeez, this is not something to joke about. Who's joking? <clears throat> However, what happens next depends on us. As long as we do not kill anyone, this will all be fine. That's the right attitude, but... Besides, I have come here to learn about your country. I would understand if this were my homeland, oh. but in this case... What? Mir redeemed us swap voices. <laughs> Lovely. Uh, let me put on the timer and go. <laughs> but in this case, this land is foreign to me. All right. Uh, what, what's that guy's name again? That's um, Igor. You're being Igor. Igor. I do not intend <laughs> to kill anyone, and I do not intend to be killed either. The way she said that sounded a little dangerous. It's 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 uh it's more of a it is Igor's like vibra uh, vibrato, but it's, yes. it's a little slightly different. Right, right. It's not totally Igor, but I definitely hear the the uh, wavering. Yes. Yeah. If this were my homeland, so would this be okay in your country? <laughs> anyway, let us forget about killings and cooperate with an with one another, so we can return home quickly. If you have any good <laughs> ideas, feel free to let me know. I shall also do my best to think of something, too. Yeah, you're right. When I speak to Sonia, I feel like this is probably <laughs> supposed to be in my mind. This should be in blue text. He, like, looks, I somehow feel... He's, he's like, <laughs> looking into the distance. <laughs> I'm right here, you know. I somehow feel really positive and optimistic. Hmm. Such oh. an honor. I guess maybe they, they did the um, translation wrong and it meant to be you, not Sonia. Because mm. he would have said it like, like when I speak to Sonia, but in Japanese, he would have just used her name. Yeah. Raise your head. There is no need to worry. What she's saying sounds odd, but she certainly looks apart. Typical of a princess, I guess. Ah, that reminds me. What was the name of your country? Yeah, I'm really curious. It was, uh... Oh, wait, wait, wait. Oh, it was Nova Selic. But also, yeah. Nova Selic? Yeah. I just remembered that shit. I'm so good. It was the Nova Selic Kingdom, right? <laughs> <laughs> it sounds as though you finally remember. Well, it's not a country I've ever heard of. Yes, that is understandable. It is often overlooked by cartographers. Uh -huh. Our Nova... S Nova Sela Kingdom is an extremely small country and governed by an absolute monarchy. Though the population is small, our economy is thriving, and we are not in dire straits at all. For generations, the royal family has protected the kingdom and its people from its neighboring countries. And thanks to that, the people still have to compete, uh, complete trust toward the royal family. And me. also, wine and chocolate is one of our country's hidden specialties. 
I see. It really does sound like a kingdom. So, since you're the princess of that kingdom, does that mean you live in a castle or something? Of course! The royal family has been living in the royal castle for over a thousand years. Though it may be old and a small, the castle is truly a wonderful historic building. Of, of course, it's easy to get lost in our subterranean labyrinth, and our <laughs> barracks are fully equipped as well. So, castles really do have those. Mm -hmm. Um, anyway, is it alright if I ask you something as well? Uh, hmm? If I can answer it, it's fine. Who did you have your heart set on initially, and who do you intend to switch <laughs> to later? <laughs> huh? This situation is truly similar to the story of the seven men and women. I believe it is a standard tactic to start wavering and swapping partners. <laughs> um, hold on. What are you talking about? Uh, do you really have no idea? It's, uh, it is Japan's legendary drama. It starts off really upbeat, but th then it gets really serious. I've never expected that to happen. I was all like, seriously? What is going to happen? I could just not, I could, I just could not take my eyes off the screen. <laughs> Momoko's feelings at the time were... Oh goodness, so intense! <laughs> I continue to listen to Sonia extensively talk about Japanese dramas. At least now, I totally understand that she's a major J-drama fangirl. She's adorable. Yep. Love her. Alright. <laughs> Alright, we had, um... Uh, line read. From Tech... Tech Diet. Oh. Hmm. Uh, you're soda right now. Oh. Being in a poly relationship is like. You're also Hajime. <laughs> I mean, well, when I'm when oh. I'm Soda, you have to be Hajime. Shut up, Soda! <laughs> so I'm confusing. going to hang out with Sonya now. Oh no! This is so sweet, Mirror. Oh, her Japanese voice actress sounds so cute, but it also sounds odd because I've gotten so used to Gang Sonya. I mean, I I'm taking that as a compliment, uh, but it could also mean that like it's just that you've heard it so long and that my voice is ingrained in your mind. Hey! Ah, uh, speaking I'm of which... I'm Sonya again. Yay! Yeah. After politely excusing myself from the long conversation with Sonya, I left the area. Yeah, she's the other flavor of weeb. I watched J-dramas for a while when I was in high school. It was fun. <laughs> Sounds like you're just barking. <laughs> Is it time to turn in our mech? <laughs> Not yet! Not yet! Tomorrow! Mm, nom, nom, nom. Ah, I mean that as a compliment as well. Thank you. <laughs> it does sound really cute. Oh, I'm just perfectly kissed. Swap mirror. Ah! Thank you. I love that. <laughs> hey, 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 hey. With the power. Like, can we of... just can we give Akane a better shovel? <laughs> like no. just, it's not good for her. Like, already her back is probably fucked up from her boobs, but now she's gotta, like, hunch over the ground like that? Yeah, it's Terrible. Right. I'm gonna go meet up with Sonya. <laughs> I'm gonna put my M&Ms down so I can do a voice. Sonya. Spend she time. Use, uses the trowel because it's better training? I don't know. I'd prefer a shovel, personally. <laughs> I am truly happy. I'm going to give you a cue. <laughs> she just turns into Terror Terror. <laughs> um, right. Did we have any other um, brightly colored jeans? Do you want to just give her more jeans? Yeah, yeah we have jeans, I think. Oh. Baby in blue jeans, baby. Is that like the Dio mask I just saw? Yeah, I saw that too, yeah. <laughs> okay, cool. Could this possibly be from the legend that has been passed down generation after generation? The Sisterhood of the Traveling Pants? I was thinking that! <laughs> <laughs> Hajime, as I thought, you must be the person that I have been anticipating. <laughs> I shall gladly take important care of this. By the way, you're really good with words. <laughs> She's so cute. Of course, I have done much studying, after all. You speak really fluently. Hi. 
Yes, I do not know how many times I have seen I will arrest your eyes. When I arrived in Japan, the first the first thing I did was run across the Spain Zaka. Ah, uh, ooh, um, I see. I don't really understand, though. <laughs> um, in my opinion, I believe the best Japanese dramas were... The ones aimed at women between the ages of 20 to 34, just before Japan's economic bubble burst. The trendiness, energy, and quality. Entertainment was truly at the zenith during this period. Uh, I, I see. It's no use, I can't keep up with what she's saying at all. And what the heck does she mean by bubble? The economic bubble. Yes, the late 80s. Ah. Like all entertainment, Japanese dramas heavily reference their native culture. Because of this, slang expressions were often used, so there are some things foreigners may not understand. Uh -huh. Hajime, if you are willing, would you train me? Train? Um, of course I can teach you some things, I understand, but... <laughs> Thank you very much. Um, so for example... When lovers go on a ski trip, they always end up trapped by a blizzard, right? In that situation, what do you call the ritual where they warm themselves under a blanket while naked? It's not really a ritual, Body heat it's... sharing. <laughs> um, how do I put it? It's more like a cliché? Oh, is that so? I certainly thought it was something that's known in my country as Makango. Ma Makango? It, it is a tradition in my country. According to tradition, lovers cannot become one until they show each other the Makangos they have grown. It, it is too embarrassing, so please do not make me say it. Embarrassing? What does a Makan go anyways? <laughs> a horrible tumor. <laughs> I cannot say. You will get a nosebleed. Is it really that embarrassing? It seems like the no <laughs> Novosela <laughs> kingdom is filled with more mysteries than I thought. <laughs> Mangoes? Yeah, it's a trope, Sonia. It's a fanfic trope. After having an awkward conversation with Sonya, I, I, I returned. I, re I was gonna say, I refused to my room. <laughs> refused? I don't want to go to my room. Where? <laughs> Usami's dragging him. <laughs> ah! Everyone, it's nighttime. Did you build me my mech or my house? <laughs> Did we? <laughs> or my army? Like, the next thing she's gonna ask for is, like, a fucking. like, missile launcher. <laughs> Yay, at least we still got our day off. I'm glad we don't get punished. Actually... Oh... We'll be one Are off. we like one off? Yeah. Oh my god! Oh, Ego, welcome back. There we go. Spend some time with Sonya. Mm -hmm. We're gonna have to like- I, I would feel so dumb if we have to like restart the entire thing just to get <laughs> one last one with Sonya. No, I think that's perfectly on brand for us. Yeah. Um... Are we out of pants? <laughs> I think so. Okay. <laughs> Try 74. It's called another battle. 74? 74. Another battle. Is it really alright for me to accept such a wonderful item? Thank you very much, Hajime. I am truly happy. I know this Is she man. saying it like that because that's how how um, Gundam names his hampers, jumpy and uh, whatever? I think <laughs> I think it's just how like I think it's supposed to be like how like when you learn a different language, on like you will just naturally emphasize a syllable differently. Yeah, I was thinking that, but then I was also like Gundam though. Uh. <laughs> uh, Tex says I'm pretty sure they keep the affection levels if we play again. I'm pretty. I mean, like. That's what it seems like, but yeah, it would be funny if we, we get to it and we're one-off. Yeah. Hajime, there is something I would like to ask you today. Sure, what? Shush, lower your voice. We do not know who might be listening in. Now then, come closer. I do a lot of hand movements when I'm uh, Sonya. I feel that. Yeah, I, a lot with Usami too, I do. I do a lot of big motions. <laughs> no need to worry. As Sonya said that, she walked up to me one step at a time. Wow, she smells nice. I bet. Hajime, do you happen to know a lot about the occult? Huh? Um, not really. 
Then what about cults? Um, not at all. So, uh, I see. You certainly are deceptive. I am finished talking to you. Let us disperse for now. What if that was just the end of the day? <laughs> what in the world were you talking about? You are hopeless. Since I have already sailed this far, I shall sink you into the ocean. That's not how you say that. <laughs> Though I understand it as a forbidden interest for a princess, I am quite interested in Freemasonry. Of course, my interest is purely academic. I have no intention of conspiring to overthrow the government. I bet, I bet despair is something you did. But when I think about Freemasonry, my chest begins to hurt. Sounds like she's in love. Oh, good night, Tag. Happy, Don happy Danganronpas and uh, Groundhog Day. Eh. However, it seems not many people understand this feeling of mine. And because of that, I feel quite lonely. Sometimes I feel like I could just cry. Hmm. Sona's hobbies are pretty intense. However, expanding my knowledge like this is the duty of every member of the royal family. And that is why I am interested in the occult, cults, and popular dramas. Hmm. Whenever she puts it like that, it sort of <laughs> makes sense, but... Hajime, please think about it. Do you not agree with dismissing a different set of values due to ignorance is foolish? What <laughs> How many foolish wars have been fought on the basis of that ignorance? My country is certainly no ex ex exception. We still have many unique traditions that other cultures would not truly understand. Unique traditions? That reminds me of, I think she mentioned one of them before, Makango. Makango. You mean Makango, right? Yes, but that is not the only one. Our country has another tradition in which you are not acknowledged as an adult until you become a skong. Until you consume a skong. <laughs> consume a skong. A skong? However, I think my generation would be objecting to these traditions. Although it is nice to retain purebred makangos and skongs as a symbol of high status, auctioning them to the highest bidder goes against the spirit of animal conservation. Wait, they're animals? <laughs> Both of them? But we do not need to completely end this tradition. I shall simply find new uses for Makangos and Skongs. They grow when they're scared and shrink when they're angered. I plan to harness the energy they release in this state. Using the knowledge of the past, we shall develop a new energy source from our old traditions. Hold on, do strange animals like that really exist in your country? I understand that it may be a difficult path. I know this, ne? However, I shall accomplish it by any means. Guiding my people along the right path is the duty of a ruler. <laughs> I said duty. <laughs> yeah, Mir says, did Sonya get reverse isekai'd by a chance? <laughs> Her people must believe she's a wonderful princess if she actually thinks of them like that. I believe that's true too, but in my eyes, Sonya and the Novosela Nova kingdom are just full of mysteries. <laughs> Let's do, uh, we've got two line reads. Oh, two? Yeah. Just two? Yeah. Sonia. Uh, Hajime, I have recently found out about the domain called AO3, and I am find many stories about you and your uke. <laughs> <laughs> nice. Um, Usami, yes. You did nothing to help me brag about how cool I am to my big brother, so I'm going to give you all the day off. Cox magic stick. Enjoy your day off, students. Tomorrow is going to be a bloodbath. Damn. Wow. Okay. <laughs> what would I like to do? Hmm. Did she give us another task? No. No, because that's wow. the end. Yeah. It's only you only get funny. fifty days to do this. Oh, this is our day off, right? So. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, we're done. That's it. It's a good task. Did we have any more, uh, another battles? Uh, I don't know. 74. <laughs> another battle. One more Stop. battle. An another one. <laughs> <laughs> um, I, I've said this a couple times. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Ego just needs to hear this really quick in Usami's voice. I am at my fucking limit! Whoa! 
Whoa! <laughs> Prepare to die, motherfucker! All right, here we go. Now then, what shall we discuss today? I would like to discuss friendship between men and women as depicted and light my heart with fire. Has something happened? How can you be so calm? We've been involved in this terrible situation for so long now. How can you have such an unchanging attitude? Excuse me, sorry. <clears throat> Do you think I am a cold woman? Huh? It is fine. I understand. Because I see something that everyone else cannot. W what is that? Destiny. Although I cannot allow killing under any circumstances, the lives of humans are shaped by destiny. Just because we make an effort to prevent danger, it does not always mean we can defy destiny. It does not mean. <laughs> Besides, my life belongs to my country and its people. If I were to die, it would be for no other reason than the sake of my country and my people. If I die here, it would be meaningful to my country and my people. So, I do not fear death. Oh, you got a, you got a big line read after this one. Oh, wow. Oh, hey, Decade. I see we're playing more of the anime adaptation of Law and Order. Yes. <laughs> the moment I was born into the royal family, I was destined not to die a meaningless death. What she's saying is so foreign to me. I am a foreigner. <laughs> They're the words of someone who lives in a world that is completely different from my own. <laughs> well, I guess that makes sense. You really are a princess. Hi. Yes, since the day I was born. I know. Also, this is not my first brush with death. Though the royal family has governed for many years, coup d'etats and terrorism still occur in our land. I too have been abducted twice by insurgents in the past. A abducted? If I showed my fear, it would fill my people with despair. That is why I had to wait in silence until rescue arrived. I actually think this situation is easier, since I can honestly change or feel fear for a change. You're expected to cope without feeling fear? I know you're princess and all, but that's still... When I am in my country, I am a princess before I am a person. That may be... but... <sighs> and because of that, I was truly looking forward to this visit. I thought when I came to Japan, I could be a regular girl. But in the end, no matter where I go, I am nothing but a princess. Right then. <clears throat> Sorry. I noticed that Sonya's My country hands of were Shinovia. <laughs> That's a Shinovia. <laughs> of course she's afraid. There's no way she wouldn't be. She's just she's just good at hiding it. But even <laughs> so, you're still a regular girl to me. I mean, I'm not a citizen of your country. I'm not even one of your vassals. So when it comes to myself and the others, you're just a classmate. Your regular girl. You don't need to try so hard. Hajime. <laughs> Thank you. I still couldn't stop her hands from shaking, but I definitely feel like we understand each other better. That much is certain. Wee. All right, big old line read. That's right. Oh, Mir says when she became despair, she must have been openly terrified. That's that's a pretty cool way to think about it. Like every it, we always assume that when people become despair, they like become evil and kill everybody. But what if she was just really freaking scared and like lets everyone in her country down? Yeah. Like that's what her despair was. Oh, that sucks. That sucks. All right, uh, <laughs> Usami, you didn't all become friends with each other before the time limit ran out. Also, you didn't help me build my army against Monokuma, so you know what? Oh my god, is that what we're doing? Is like, if we, if Monokuma hadn't have shown up, we'd have been building an army. <laughs> well, I guess not, because we're in a simulation, but... Maybe my big brother had the right idea. From this day forward, we're starting the killing games again! Monomi! Monomi, no! Do not make me the voice of reason! That would be a horrible <laughs> idea! Yeah. If you're talking about some Fuck other- Fuck you, I really wanted that robot! <laughs> Couldn't even get a house out of you fuckos! <laughs> There's 16 of you, I think, could make a house! 
<laughs> I gave you nine this days. It's not really that hard. I'm asking seriously. I'm just a robot. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> I gave you guys nine days to build a house. <laughs> After talking about some other things for a while, I parted ways with Sony and returned to my room. And that's all she wrote, I guess. Everyone, it's that time. <laughs> all right. Day 50. Like, do we get day 50 or is it over? It says holiday. Oh. Oh no. Everyone, at last we've reached the final day of this school trip. Have you properly collected the <laughs> <laughs> Her fan, I don't know why she got so scared. <laughs> Whether you cry or laugh, time runs out tomorrow. So, oh, we do get this last day. So live your last day here with no regrets. Oh, cool. Dude, do we get like a double day? Looks like it. I think we get to finish Sonya then. Oh, wow, okay. All right, I think we're out of another battle. Do we have 86 Century Potpourri? We might not. Yeah, I, we, a few people have asked we, for Potpourri. We, we've been running out oh, of... We have one more. Yeah. That's okay if we don't, but we, we should just check. <laughs> At least. <laughs> so good. Ha ha ha! Come on, get silly and laugh with me. <laughs> what? Giggle, oh, giggle, 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 giggle! If you all get silly, that <laughs> intro. What, what? What number is it again? Eighty-six. <laughs> Eighty-six. <laughs> nope. Nope. All right. Uh, do we have any Ramune? Nope. No. Okay. Uh, number five, Civet Coffee. We have one Civet Coffee. Give her some coffee. Delicioso. <laughs> yum, 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 yum. We saw me snaps clip. I can't wait to see that. Yeah. May I really have this? <laughs> Thank you very much. You are truly kind. <laughs> now then, what shall we discuss today? Anna. And, um, you know. If it pleases you, would you like to come to my room? I am certain we will feel more relaxed there than being outside. Hmm. Gosh. Come, let us go. I feel like Sonya's trying a little too hard today. Maybe something happened. For now, I decided to walk to Sonya's cottage. I am terribly sorry. I have not kept this place very clean. Oh my god, her room is the cutest! It seems clean enough to me. It's adorable! R really? I do not have much experience taking care of myself, so there are still things I do not understand. I know. Well, I got a little, like, accent-y in the end there. <laughs> Thus far, I have managed to understand how to turn on the shower. But I did not know I also had to turn it off, so I accidentally flooded the floor. I guess that sounds like something a princess would do. No, it doesn't. So what happened? <laughs> huh? Well, what? Well, something happened, right? You're acting a little different than usual, so... How... how could you tell? Uh, I'm not sure. I could tell just by looking at you. If you can tell, then I guess I cannot hide things from you. She looked a little relieved when she said that and gave me a relaxed smile. She seems to understand that she doesn't need to try so hard. I had a nightmare. Nightmare? A nightmare where something dreadful had happened, and I was unable to return to my homeland. <laughs> and when I woke up, I felt extremely scared, and... Oh, I, I want to go home, right now! I want to go back to my homeland where my family and people are waiting for me! As she shouted, Sonia collapsed, and... Whoa, Sonia! I managed to catch her before she hit the ground. She was crying. Sobbing and scared out of her wits like a normal girl. Right now, she's finally acting normal. She's been holding it in for so damn long. I held her and patiently waited for her to stop trembling. And went home. That's the thing like they went... <laughs> yeah, ah, anyway. uh, good night. <laughs> Are you alright now? Y yes um I, know. I feel much better thanks to you. My energy seems to have returned somewhat. Though her eyes were still a little red, Sonia finally showed me her smile. Hajime, I finally realized what you are. A vampire. <laughs> <laughs> Say it out loud. 
Imagine if Gundam were here instead of Hajime. I am. I really am. <laughs> you completely match the description of the legendary hero passed down in my country. Say what? <laughs> um, the legend goes like this. The hero wears a white shirt and possesses an antenna that can sense danger. <laughs> that can sense danger. With a face lacking distinguishing characteristics, he shall bring light to the tropical land. Are you serious? I know this, ne? There is no mistake. The legend must be speaking of you, Hajime. Is her land supposed to be tropical? I know she's talking about the island, but like if it's a legend in her yeah, it's, uh, yeah. country, I, I, she has a tropical land? No, I think it's just some small like small country in, in Europe. I, yeah, because I imagined it to be like a kind of a cold place. Yeah. I don't, she doesn't dress like she's from the tropics. <laughs> um, you wear a white shirt just like the legend says, and your hair looks like an antenna. And your face is completely unremarkable. Please, stop it already. <laughs> According to the legend, he has a tiny penis <laughs> and rides a broom. <laughs> Quick, let me see. <laughs> According to legend, the hero will stand alongside the princess and freely swing the golden Mockingo. A Mockingo is a I'm animal, I'm still thinking right? is like a rat, yeah. <laughs> is it really okay to swing around a living creature? It's <laughs> And then, the legend says they will establish something resembling order and prosperity to the kingdom. Wait, not actual order and prosperity, just a resemblance? <laughs> something may be lost in translation, I don't really know. After all this, Hajime... So, you were my destined one. Um, that's totally not it. Hajime, when we safely escape this island, please come with me to the Novoselic Kingdom. And then, when the time comes, let us capture the Golden Mockingo. <laughs> if you do, you will be formally acknowledged as the legendary hero. And you will be able to rule the Novoselic Kingdom alongside me. Does, does that mean? But a life like that doesn't sound so bad. No, uh, yeah, no. actually it sounds awesome. No, it doesn't. However, you might need to study a bit more before you can become my husband and the King of Novoselic. You will need to know 30 foreign languages, economics, international law, diagnostic medicine. How am I supposed to do all that? I'll be an old man before I'm finished! <laughs> like, baby way you said, how am I supposed to do all that? <laughs> Let us do our very best. Well, anyway, I'm glad Sony feels better now. <laughs> I'm sure everyone else won't be won't feel the like their usual selves if they don't see Sonya smile. I can feel I, I can I can feel a strong bond with Sonya, and as long as I have this bond, I will never give up. I swear I'll leave this island with everyone. All right, we ding, have ding. the hope. Oh, 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 Mr. Mr. Congeniality. We have all the hope, we have all the hope fragments. And, and we, penalties. What are those? I, I, I can't wait to read about them. I don't actually know. Let's take a look. Oh, uh, Amanda says actually because of Izuru, Hajime has learned all of that already. Oh wow, that's true. She doesn't remember. <laughs> hey, Sonia's favorite regal undergarments, the modest lace, conveys an air of refined sophistication. So they're like bloomers or something, yeah. I guess. That's cute. Uh, line read real quick before we have. Oh yeah, yeah. The game. Oh no, my hoagie ho doesn't detect danger. It lets Mitch and Game Mudo control me. <laughs> the velvet room attendants from Legends. <laughs> <laughs> awesome. After listening to Sonya's plans for the future, I returned to my room, exhausted. Ugh, kill me. What would I like to do now? And then I went back outside. I go meet with someone. Oh, we can date with someone really quick. Who do we want to go out with? I know who I want to go out with. Yay! Where are we going? We're gonna go to Nagido. Yeah, we're, we're with Nagido. I don't know. Where do you- Yeah. Where, okay, I picked the person, you picked the place. Oh gosh. Are, it's- this the whole list. Oh, let's go to the beach. Each. Let's go get away. <laughs> okay, yeah. Uh, let me double check. On All right, so you'll be Nagito. What um what do you what do you call this again? Trip ticket? Yeah. Well, actually, remember uh Ego gave us the answer already. Well, uh, Ego didn't say that was I don't know if that's the right answer. It's Ego just told answer. us what happens when you say that. Yeah. <laughs> We could say that, but let me, let me, I'm just curious what, what you should say. All right. Uh, 
I guess there's a, a bunch of different things he might ask, so... Okay. Um, we'll see when, when we get there. We arrived at the beach! Beach! Oh, do I? Should I be Hajime yeah, since you're yeah. being Nagido? All right. A vast blue ocean and smooth white sand. Truly, this spot befits a tropical island. It looks like there's no one else here except us. What should we do now? Okay. Um. Oh yeah, like you can't. So the correct answer here is sandcastle. Okay. Should we do it? What? Make a sandcastle? Yeah. yeah. Great idea! That seems much safer. But I can totally see a huge wave rolling in and destroying our castle before it's finished. What happened to being the goddamn ultimate oak? To be honest, I've never really safely completed anything I've tried to make. Also, I I'm the Luxter, remember? Yeah. I have Let's take our clothes off is actually a medium answer. Oh, wow. When offered that. His hated answer is, let's go running. <laughs> But if I'm gonna, Mine too. <laughs> but if I'm gonna make it with you, then it might turn out okay. Aww. All right, let's try it. So cute. It looks like he had a really good time. Wait, is that it? I think I. I guess the saying "time flies when you're having fun" was true. For some reason, it scares me to think that. Uh, for some reason, it scares me to think that I'm having fun without experiencing any bad luck. I mean, I feel so lucky right now that it wouldn't surprise me if one or two people I knew had died. But, but I should stop thinking about such dangerous things and get ready to go home to our love nest. What? <laughs> okay, yeah. Yeah, let's go to our love nest. Everyone, today is the last night of the school trip. You've all worked so hard these past 50 days. I... I'm very sad to think we'll be saying goodbye tomorrow. You didn't build me a house. <laughs> <laughs> I'm homeless. <laughs> Will we even be able to safely say goodbye to each other? What does that mean? Anyway, make sure you prepare for tomorrow and get plenty of rest. Good night. We got all the hope fragments. Does that mean we get like a special like, like a kiss from Usami? Yeah, I guess. Oh, look, look at that. We're all here together. We graduate, and there was hope all day. That morning, Usami looked at each of our faces and nodded softly. Mm, Just we're by graduating. that, we immediately knew that the time had come. We had finally completed the 50 days, and we were finally going to go home. I guess we should say goodbye to this island now. It's strange. Our time here felt a little too long and a little too short. Hmm. Yeah, it was like a normal school trip. <laughs> Though I don't think that this can really be called normal. Huh? This isn't like a normal school trip. This isn't what a normal school trip is supposed to be like. <laughs> Damn it! You tricked us. No wonder I thought it was so lame. <laughs> no, no, no! A normal school trip is even lamer. Hmm. You're right. School trips don't normally abduct students and force them to survive on a tropical island. <laughs> Who cares about the details? I mean, it was super fun. <laughs> You're right. I had a lot of fun, too. Why are you stealing my line? I was just about to say that. Hi, hi. There, there. Don't cry. It doesn't matter. <laughs> it's just goddamn, like, barrage of me. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> That's a right. A stop of fighting. Come, look at my loins and be at the peace. <laughs> Yes, after all, Terry Terry's tenderloins can only be useful in situations like this. <sighs> Personally, I'm disappointed. I'm still here and you're all still here. Nobody died. What the fuck? You're still acting all depressed? You should be honest and admit you had fun. <laughs> An ending with no missing parts. However, I guess this is just one ending of many. Aww. It looks like everyone had something they wanted to say, but right now, we all felt, feel the same way. Our life here was just really fun. But fun was probably something we really needed right now. Nah. Hey, Hajime. Just what were the hope fragments anyway? What do you think? We... What do you think we really obtained on this island? 
What did we really obtain This is your here? last test. It's probably... Oh, God. Oh. Do you want me to look it up? Yes, please. <laughs> I just want to be sure, yeah. Um, uh, Dangan, Rompa, Island, I want to say a bond. Mode, last answer. Uh, that's what I think, too, but I, I just want to be sure. Um, it would suck if we fucked this up right at the very last moment. Uh... Island mode strategy wiki. What's the very last thing? I'm gonna say a bond. Wait, wait, shoot, can we save? No. Uh, wait, uh, I'm so all scared. All right, all right, I'll do, I'll do a line read while you're looking it up. Okay, okay. Shame, no one died. Hajime hiding the killing game save files behind him. Hey, babe, I got something for you. Chucky stealing the save files. Nope, it's last session. Uh, no, Gmod. Just, just yeah. be. Just be. Yeah. Nope. It's the last session. No god money on the last day. That's my jockey voice, I guess. I can't do like your like super nasal. Gang, I think it'll. Mm. I think it'll be fine. I think it's a bond. You think it's a bond? All right, go for bond. It's definitely a bond, right? A connection between people, something like that. <laughs> hmm. So you say the chain that links yourself is hope. But beyond that chain is something else. A light that can shine on any darkness. Mm. Bonds between people contain hope? If so, hope is easier and simpler than I thought. <laughs> Even if your life is filled with unforeseeable bad luck, as long as we all have this bond, we'll, be all, we'll all be better off. In these Aww. past several days, each and every one of us has obtained something. Before we came here, we all felt like we were alone in this world. We all felt like we could do anything on our own. But we didn't realize that, that's, that that path only leads to despair. We were brought to this island, and as we looked back, we realized that we weren't alone. As long as we hold someone's hand, despair wanes. If it's not possible with two people, do it with three. If it's not possible, then even more. And now we stand here today without losing a single person. It looks like everyone was able to find their own hope. Hey, I got that. I'm glad, everyone. Really. What? You so Now, let me, let me tell you that uh, I'm not real, <laughs> and you're all terrible people, and you're going to wake up horribly injured. All right. Yeah. <laughs> See you later. <laughs> you sound like you're not part of this. You're included in that everyone, you know. You spent this time together with us. No matter what happens, that will never change. Ever. That's right. Ah, we definitely gotta throw a reunion party soon. Oh. A reunion party for a school trip? Wouldn't it be more like a launch party? <gasps> I have never experienced either of those. We should definitely do both of them. <laughs> then make sure you guys are telling me what you like to eat. I'll make sure to cook it with a gusto. <laughs> as long as it's edible, I'm fine with anything. Man, you guys are too hasty. <laughs> You're right. The first thing we all need to do is go back. Back to where we belong. That's right. We have to go back. To our daily lives filled with school, studying, exams, fights, walks, train rides, lectures, and more. Oh, none Together of that's happening. with everyone here. With renewed I don't hope. know what's sadder is Monokuma's despair game or knowing that these guys are all having a wonderful time and they're gonna wake up to like apocalypse. Yeah, that's super true. Right? With renewed hope and maybe even a little despair, everyone is going to start their lives once again. I will save. Is that it? Oh my god. That feels sad that like there was no like waking up. I, oh, man, I'm just so curious about what happens after. Oh, that's it. Oh, God. Oh. Oh, uh, line read real quick. Oh. You guys are so sweet, but also I'm an AI, so bye. <laughs> Chachi's execution place. Oh, oh, that's that's it. Oh. That's that's the end of Danganronpa. Like, I can't believe it. Oh, we're we even went over a little bit. Well, I mean, we had to finish. This. Yeah. Yeah. Wow. That's crazy. I don't know what, like, I mean, I know we, we're gonna have other things that we do, but I feel like, what? No dog and Ropa? How am I, how am I gonna come into this, like, 
and we play a different game. That's just, it's crazy. That doesn't happen. We did it for like, oh god, we started this playthrough like I think in July. Yeah, it was summer for sure. Yeah. So now like... it's winter. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> <laughs> it's been like half a year. It took us like half a year to play this game. <laughs> Maybe a little more. But you know what? You know what? I had a super awesome time. Yeah. Uh, it was July fifteenth, twenty twenty-two. Damn. Damn. <laughs> we uh, we're so uh, you know I just wanted to say real quick. I'm so happy that you guys have stuck around with us throughout this adventure. Um, we started this game. Like as kind of like a thing where we both wanted to like we both wanted to play Dongan Two, and wanted to do it together, and it was it was so much fun, and I'm just really happy that you guys uh, joined us for this little adventure, and uh, yeah, yeah, same same here. That that was such a fun game, and I can't wait to do Dongan Three someday. We definitely won't do it right away, but like I look forward to the next chapter. That's, yeah, it's a really good series to do for us, especially. Like we love to get lost in very complex games like this, don't we? Oh like, yeah. Persona and Dongan, where where characters are like, God, we love to talk. We just love to hear our voices. Don't well, we? We just we hey, we love to uh, we love to have fun with it. Yeah. We love to have we love to have like our little characterization. Also, real quick, I'm gonna share all the little emotes we have now, thanks to this game. I'm just gonna put yeah. like, if you yeah if you uh, I, we have like a bunch of little emotes now that we have for you guys to use <laughs> when we play the game. Yeah, they're really cute. I love them all. <laughs> uh, yeah. That Monokuma one kills me. Like. Yeah, I mean that's the thing. Like this, this is a game I'm gonna remember super fondly. Like this is a game that like is just. I don't remember the. Um, I'm sorry, I don't remember Chuck E. Cheese. <laughs> <laughs> when did that happen? There's a story behind that. Who snuck that in there? <laughs> no, it was me. I did that. <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> sorry, please continue. All, all of them except for Waka and <laughs> Chuck E. Cheese are related <laughs> to this playthrough, and uh, True. and uh, yeah, I just want to say thank you all so Ow. much for. For being so, uh, for being just awesome and being here and following us all the way to the end, and yeah, so next time we play will be next Thursday. Um, where Gang and I will be starting a new game. Uh, it's not going to be nearly as long as Danganronpa Two, um, no. but we will we will have some fun and it's another visual novel. I mean, I mean, Y'all love these visual novels, so and I love these yeah. visual novels. I'm not even sure what it is. What are we doing? Uh, I can't tell them. It's a surprise. Oh, surprise! Yeah. Got it. All right, guys. But thank you all so much for watching. If you have not checked out the, if you have not checked out uh, the rest of the playthrough, uh, there's it's all on YouTube. <laughs> it's all there. Yeah, true. And you are. Oh, can I shamelessly plug? Yeah, go for it. Okay. Uh, sorry, I just wanted to say we're not um, doing save point on Tuesday because I have usurped Tuesday. I am going to do a Hogwarts Legacy. Uh, playthrough on my stream. It's a charity cosplay stream. I'm going to dress up as Ebony, Darkness, Dementor, Ravenway, and we're raising money for the Trevor Project. I say we, I mean me and anyone who's there. Uh, the Trevor Project, which is a, an organization that uh, helps stop um, suicide amongst LGBTQ plus groups. So let's, I, I'd love to see some of you guys there. I understand if, no, if you don't want to come. I get it. So don't worry about like hurting my feelings or anything. But, but I think it might be fun. It'll be at gang, five. Who else will talk about the soul pool? Ten p.m. Yeah, we, we're gonna we're gonna talk about the soul pool and have horrible jokes and it will be terrible. Oh, I love be... it. I'm so excited. <laughs> I really am excited. I the idea is that it's really gonna be trending that day because that's when all the pre-orders are coming out. And I'm like, hey, if it's gonna be if I'm gonna get a lot of foot traffic from that, let's. Uh, Guilt some people into donating to some LGBT <laughs> charities. How about that? Fuck yeah, dude. All yeah. right, guys. Thank you all so much for watching another episode, and we'll catch you all on Tuesday. Or actually, Monday for guys. me, because I'll, I'll do the watch. Yeah. We gotta I'll watch more Hell of a Boss. Some of you on Tuesday and yeah. Monday. Maybe I'll show up. We'll see if I can. Yeah. Yes. We're just gonna watch more Hell of a Boss, honestly. So, all right, later, oh, yeah, skaters. I love hell of a boss. All right, bye. Love you. Kisses. <laughs>